Hey everybody, welcome back. It's Skyrim for Pimps Season 2. We got a brand new person. We're replacing Fun Tits. Foon Tits, sorry. Yeah, we're, we're not replacing her. She's no. doing her thing. We left Foon in a night in a good place, and maybe we'll go visit her at some point. Yeah. But, um, for now, we're moving on to the story of... Crotch Guzzler. Crotch Guzzler. Crotch Guzzler, yes. Um, Do you have a problem with that? Crotch Guzzler, are you are you serious? Out of all the names you could have picked, you picked Crotch Guzzler. Well, yeah, it's a, this is another example of a family name that goes down through the ages. This is the first Crotch Guzzler, but there's been a number of different Guzzlers. So Guzzler is an Elven household. Yeah, well, let's take a look at the family tree, shall we? So here you go. It started all the way back with Cum Guzzler. He was the original Guzzler. And, you know, as they went down through the years, there was a lot of different, you know, marriages and branches. But then eventually you end up with Crotch Guzzler. So anyway, Crotch Guzzler, uh, he got kicked out of the house. He was about 230 years old. He'd been living at home for a long time. 230, yeah. And his elf parents were really getting sick of it. So they sent him off. He kind of, you know, fucked around for a little while, burning foxes. You know, every so often he would fill a wheelbarrow full of his own shit and push it into a village and then just light it on fire and run. <laughs> uh, he is just a little bit of a prankster, but, you know, he's starting to... I feel like he's starting to wise up now, and he's just like, yeah, I think I better go uh, do something with my life. All these practical jokes are getting old. Time to go to college. Where do you want to go? Hey, man, take me to the College of Magic. Climb and back, and we'll be off. Fifty gold? You've raised your prices. <laughs> Dude, how can you afford this? You're a college student. It's worse than the price of textbooks. I'm off to college. How are you guys doing today? Yeah. All right, well, I guess that's why you're guards. You don't even have a goat to speak for them. Cross the bridge at your own peril. You shall not gain entry. Like, can I just pay a tuition or something, ma'am? Why are you out here? The more important question is, why are you here? I just want to fuck people up with ice and fire, ma'am. Those wishing to enter must show some degree of skill with magic. A small test, if you will. Uh, I guess I'll take your test, as long as it's not a urine test. Because that might be a problem. All right, don't fail this test. Well done, indeed. I think Thanks. you'll be a superb addition to the college. Okay. Welcome, apprentice. Dude, that teacher is hot. She is hot. I hope they're all like this. So how much research did you do, like, on picking this college? Were there any other colleges you were looking into, or you just picked this, the first one? The only college that sent me a pamphlet in the mail was this one, so <laughs> I just figured I'd go with it. Welcome to the college. Oh, thank you. I'll give you a brief tour, and then we'll get you to your first class. Are you ready to begin? Class? She's going to get me to my first class? Your first class. Please follow me, and don't wander off. I wonder if they have a football team here. Ah, oh, wonderful. Wow, this is great. <laughs> you know, I uh, originally applied to Hogwarts, but uh, I got denied, so I had to come here. It's like the DeVry of magic colleges. <laughs> DeVry Institute for Magic <laughs> and Boredom. Hey, at least you don't have a roommate. That's like the worst part of college. Oh, this is my room? Yeah. I, I get all this? I get my own skull? <laughs> <laughs> Look, I got my own skull, lady. Woo! <laughs> Calm down, dude. It's your first day of college. You Woo, don't want to make an idiot of yourself. Oh, where are you going? Initially, you'll be learning from Tolfdir, one of our most esteemed wizards. Tolfrey? Is he like? To, is he a, a telemarketer? <laughs> <laughs> Tolfrey. <laughs> Can you just walk a little bit faster? Dude, it's school. There's always got to be that person in front of you that just walks slow <sighs> as fuck. Yay! Hey, everybody. Look, I'm here. Where's the booze? <laughs> We were just beginning. Who wants to party? I choked on his head. Wah. What do you think we should do? Oh, well, I wasn't paying attention. Um, I am not really sure what to think. Oh, God, I kind of don't care, buddy. Who'd have thought Magic College would be so boring? Hey, Anmund, how's it going? New here, too, eh? I'd hoped I wouldn't be the only Nord. But I should have known better. Yeah. Uh, bye. You are new, yes? Have you mastered the expert level destructions? Uh, I didn't know they had pets in this uh, college. <laughs> 
I don't know. Majors College, off to a bad start. <laughs> yeah, well, you know, the first day of college is always the worst. You know, you got to sit through fucking orientation and all that shit. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, and there are no hot girls in your class. It's just a cat man and a I know. faggot. <laughs> That's the new, the new series from Fox, Catman and the Faggot. You realize how offensive that is. Is it? I just want you to realize that so that we can include it in the video and not feel guilty. <laughs> okay, where's Tall, tall Free? Oh. oh, we're going to Sarthal. Oh, good. An adventure. Yeah, it's your first field trip. All right, well, I'm kind of enjoying getting out of the college already. Yeah, that place is pretty stifling. Where's Sarthal? How do I get to Sarthal? Maybe there's some public transportation that'll go there. What the hell's going on here? What are you guys doing? Tolfter, what are you doing? Oh, hey. What? Why are you killing this goat? <laughs> why is Tolfter attacking this goat? <laughs> oh my god. I don't want to be taught by someone who just goes around and randomly kills goats. <laughs> okay, I'm at Sarathal. Hello. All right, you're the first one to get here. What? Well, yeah, that's because Tollfree is off killing rabbits now, probably, and anything else that's completely harmless. <laughs> oh, this is how great wizards work. They kill everything. <laughs> Constantly <laughs> practicing. Hey, Anman. I'm not so sure we should be here. Huh, fascinating. Get the fuck out of my way. Well, are there any questions before we begin? What? Why do you always talk to me? Why don't you talk to any other students? <laughs> I think I know why. <laughs> Why else would a horny old teacher man lead three people into a deep, dank cave in the middle oh of nowhere? Oh my god, you're right. Oh god, he's probably already drugged us. Alright, so the horny old teacher man told you to look for artifacts. Alright, here's something. Uh, yeah. Enchanted ring. Ooh, another enchanted ring. Woo! Yeah, that's three enchanted rings. Oh look, I found an ancient amulet. Woo! What's going on? It was a trap! How in the world did that happen? Yeah, he just, he said that like, how in the world did that happen? <laughs> like, I didn't oh, do that. There must be something about that amulet. Have you tried putting it on? Oh, no, I haven't. It's a good thing this game was like designed for children and retards to be able to play. Because there's no way you could get through it. Children and retards. If it was even remotely difficult. That's really nice, Emery. Whoa, cool. Gas fumes. Oh, dude, I'm going to get so high. <laughs> yeah, that's some door breaking action. Nice. What's going on, old man? What's happening? Wow. Oh, God, what's going on? Maybe you did get high off those fumes. I think so. Well, well. Know that you have, so you have set in motion a chain of events that cannot be stopped. 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 Judgment will be based on your actions to come. 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 And how you deal with the dead dangers ahead of you. This warning is passed to you because the Jig Order believes in you. Crush, Ghoster! And you alone have the potential to take our shit and know that the Order is watching. <laughs> so, what the hell was that? Some sort of Ghoster apparition, I guess. <laughs> it spoke to me. You don't seem phased. This stuff happened a lot while you're on acid. Ah! ah! Monsters! Yeah, did you see how cool I was there? <laughs> that was awesome. Oh, yeah. Took a couple arrows to the knee right there. I don't think I can adventure anymore. I've never seen anything like this in Nordic ruins before. Um, well, what this is is called the Draugr Barrow. The Draugrs live down here. Um, actually, they're all dead, but then they come back alive when you come down here. You have to kill them all, and then usually there's some sort of treasure at the end. I've done them about five million times. Okay? History lesson for today is finished. You Why? stupid son of a bitch. Oh, it's a puzzle! Wonderful! I don't feel like solving this. Do you want me to solve it for yeah. you? Yeah. Whoa, Tolfter, check this out. This is kind of neat. Just kidding, it's pretty boring. All right, <laughs> well, let's move on. Why is this buried so far with huh? Wait, what the fuck are you doing? <laughs> Whoa! Jerick Galderson? Holy shit, he sold me my car. What the hell's he doing? Now attack him? Now attack him? Oh, okay. Jerick. Ah! Uh, <laughs> Tolf Deer, that's not working. Help, Tolf Deer. <laughs> Try a different spell. Maybe he's resistant to fire. Ah, oh, yeah, that does it. Alright, that was a good idea. 
Yeah, suck it, Derek Fired Nargers. What the fuck was his name? Call 847-268. That's Jared Calderson Chevrolet. Chevrolet. So uh, that was kind of fun, right, Tolf Deer? This is simply fascinating. Oh. Hmm. Can you think of any other adjectives that maybe... <laughs> Anything. Wow! Neato! This is really special. I've enjoyed this. I can't believe how lucky I am to be here. I am having such a good time here. Wow! This is fascinating. I guess I'll stand here for a little while. Interesting. Dirt! Oh! Go! Da! Hoop! What is this anyway? It's like a big Marilyn Monroe statue. Yeah, like the wind is totally pushing up this magician's robe. And Ooh. He's getting all sexy. Or he's just letting a huge one rip. Well, here we are back in the dorms. Jazargo, what are you fucking doing in my room? <laughs> Get the fuck out of here. This he is just walks in and sits on your chair. Well, he can't even sit on my chair because there's skulls on it. So he's standing. Dude, dude, get out of here. Obviously, you've never had a pet cat before because all they do is go into places they shouldn't be and then jump on all your furniture. You're yeah. just lucky he's not pissing all over your shit. Probably, if that's what he's waiting for. <laughs> he's waiting he's for you to turn around and yeah, leave. Yeah, as soon as I leave the room, he's going to piss over all my... He's going to piss over everything. All right, so I got to go talk to the dean. I don't know what I did. Whoa, fancy duds. Wow. Pays to be the dean, I guess. Huh? Yeah. I need to speak to you about Sarthal. We found some sort of orb. Toll Free wants you to see it. He's really fucking excited about it. Thank you for bringing this to my attention. You're welcome. Speak with Urog in the Arcanium. See if he's aware of anything that matches your discovery. Jeez, man. <laughs> Just tons of boring quests here. You to go talk to Urog and then read a book. You know... Maybe just sit in a chair for a while and just kind of look at the walls. Disrupt my Arcanium, and I will have you torn apart by angry Atronauts. Oh, I know. I hate it when my Arcanium gets disrupted, <laughs> if you know what I mean. So, uh, Urog, is there uh, any college business I can assist with in any exciting, possibly really interesting, vibrant, enjoyable way? If you're feeling adventurous, I'm always looking for someone to procure valuable books from some more dangerous locations. Oh. Hmm, good thing you asked exactly that way. Well, all right. Here. Thanks, Groshrub. Find the stolen books. So what, am I a librarian now? Apparently. I've changed from being a magician to a librarian. But you're like a badass librarian. Like... Like Conan the librarian. Yeah! Yeah. That's a good way to look at it. You there. Yes? I have questions for you. Okay. You were in Sarfo, yes? I guess. It has come to my attention that something was found there. I don't know, man. Maybe. I know full well that you have. What? Please do not insult my intelligence. Fuck your intelligence. Your intelligence sucks. I bet he's only got like a 16. Yeah, he's and only got a 16 intelligence. intelligence. Loser. All right, so now we begin the exciting quest of find some books and bring them back to the library. Oh, shit. We got trouble. This boring quest has been interrupted by an epic dragon fight. Now that's what I'm talking about. Hey, leave my fellow students alone. Leave them alone, they're my friends. Yeah. Felglo Keep Dungeons. This is where Urag suggested I go to look for these books. Hey, I'm looking for some books. Oh, where'd you go, man? <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, <laughs> holy <laughs> shit. That guy, he did a little kung fu before he fucking died. That was awesome. He's like an extra in a Bruce Lee film. <laughs> yeah, man. I'm here for the books from the college. So you're just one of Oren's lackeys. No, I'm just a student. Perhaps we can come to an arrangement where you get naked and I have sex with you. <laughs> know what I mean? I'm in college, so, you know, I like sex. I don't think this is going to end well for me. I'm just going to go get those books. <laughs> do, 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 do. Where'd the book go? Did they knocked the book off? Yeah. God damn it, bitch. Okay, I'll be leaving now. Bye. Well, that was exciting. You got your books. You'd think that they would just send them, you know, a letter with some, you know, library fines. Pay the extra, you know, like 25 cents or whatever. Yeah, and, and then they could just send the books back via, you know, postal dragon. You should start your own library. And you could charge people money to rent the books. You could call it Cockbuster. Wait, what? I call my library Cockbuster? Yeah. Why would I do that? Because, you know, it's got, an, like, an intriguing name. People can bust their cocks reading your books. Cockbuster. I don't understand that. Here's the fucking books. Well, well. Yeah. 
Hey, <laughs> stop fucking munching your bread. I just about got killed like 50 times finding these fucking books. This guy really reminds me of Nazier. <sighs> He's like the uglier, stupider, angrier version of Nazier. What, uh, what have you got for sale? I have a few things laying around that weren't worth adding to the collection. Okay. You seem really angry about that. I'm sorry I asked. I get the feeling that this guy, if you were just like, hey, man, how's it going? How, how, how's the weather today? And be like, it's kind of sunny outside. It's kind of about perfect temperature, like 70 degrees. I walked outside and I saw some fucking animals. This morning, I decided to eat breakfast. It was really tasty. My daughter's getting married. It's the happiest day of my life, goddammit. <laughs> hey, Colette Mantrub, can I talk to you? You consider Restoration a valid school of magic? Worthy of study, don't you? No, Restoration's for idiot asshole dipshits, fuck you. Well, I'm glad we've established this early. Rather than me hearing about it years or decades later when the whispers behind my back are loud enough. Decades later? What the hell are you talking How about? How old are you? Am I gonna be seeing you decades from now? Are we getting married? <laughs> Is this how college works? <laughs> Someone just chooses God, you? God, I thought this was a four-year degree. What am I supposed to do now? Oh, speak with Tolf Durr. Look at this. He's so fascinated by it, and he just stands here all day. And he's like, dude, <laughs> fascinating. So many colors. Wow. Um, but Rag suggested I come and see you. Did he now? Stop t doing that. Does he have information about our wonderful discovery? Yes, he had information about your fascinating and wonderful discovery. Whatever this is, its beauty is like nothing I've ever seen before. Oh my god. If you'd allow me to <laughs> indulge myself for a moment. No, I don't want you indulging yourself around me at all. <laughs> Stop it. Stop that! Listen to Tolf, dear. Okay. <laughs> I, whoever suggested we do this quest needs to get slapped. They were playing a fucking prank on us, I'm they? sorry, but they must have known that three quarters of it is walking around listening to some gibbering old man talk about how fascinating everything is. <laughs> what are you doing in here, pussweed? Do you wear lipstick? Do you have contacts? Are you a glam rocker? I need you to come with me immediately. Let's go. Where? I'd like to know why there's someone claiming to be from the Sigic Order here in the college. More importantly, I'd like to know why he's asking for you, specifically. Oh boy, I probably knocked up his lady friend or something, you know? Oh yeah, there was that party you went to last weekend. Yeah, where I had sex with 50 women. Yeah. That was a good party. Yeah, it was 50, Ancano. 50. 50 women. In one night. And I wasn't wearing lipstick like you either. Nor protection. Take your time there, I just want to watch that ass. Look at that ass. Yeah, out of everybody in Skyrim, he probably does have the most interesting ass. He does. Yeah. He he designed his ass well. Oh, excuse me. <laughs> I wasn't <laughs> looking. I, I'm sorry. <laughs> I think that his, his magic comes from his butt. He's got a magic ass. Ancano of the magic ass. Please do not be alarmed. What? I mean you no harm. Oh, God. Here we go again. It's this fucking guy. Your face is fucking weird. <laughs> Dude, he's like frozen in time. It is good to meet you in person. I don't want to talk to you. Can you go home? <laughs> I'm, I'm busy. Oh, can I steal stuff? Nice. This is a good opportunity to take everything in here. All right, what do you want? The situation here at your college is of dire importance. Really? And so I have come here personally to tell you it must be dealt with. That was nice of you, man. You're pretty neat. I like you. So, uh, what exactly is the problem? And kind of pick up the pace here because I'm starting to get kind of sleepy. Seek out the Augur of Dunlane here in your college. His perception may be more coherent than ours. Where can I find this Augur? I... I am unsure. Oh, okay, great. Thank you. I just want to point out this, uh, this quest. All the things I did in this quest so far are fucking dumb. <laughs> Look. Speak with Quarnir, follow Ankano, listen to Tolfdir, speak with Tolfdir. <laughs> wow, the adventure was endless. <laughs> and the mighty hero spoke with Quarnir. And afterwards, he followed the great Ankano. And then after that, he journeyed into the basement and listened to Tolfdir. And finally, when all was done, he spoke with mighty and it was epic. The bards will sing of this, the amazing feats in the quest of good intentions. Oh, 
Okay, now who do I have to talk to? Whose dick do I have to suck to complete this quest? <laughs> so this is where all the freshmen live. This is the freshman wing. And, yeah, in the mid... Ooh, wow, it's chilly down here. Yoo-hoo! <laughs> Anybody down here? A bloody sleeping bag. Nice. Why is there Draugr hanging out in the basement of the college? Yeah, the one janitor that roams the basement of the college. <laughs> <laughs> He wasn't a drugger at all. He was just a janitor. Ooh. Iron Dagna, Dag, Dagna, Iron da Vagina of Weariness. Oh God, I hate those. Who's Hello? talking? Hello. Still, you persist. Very well. What? You may answer. I can't. I can't hear you. Can you speak up? Uh. You don't look like an auger. I am that which you have been seeking. The most boring thing in Skyrim. <laughs> what am I seeking? Seek that which all who wield magic seek. Knowledge. Hmm, knowledge. You shall find this. Knowledge. Why does he have such huge pauses in between his sentences? It will consume. You see it's like, me? It's like a second and a half worth of pausing. Just in case you want to go make a pizza or <laughs> take a break. God, my back hurts, Auger of Dunlin. <laughs> Can you f fucking hurry this up? You know what would made this better? If they got Morgan Freeman to do the voice of the Auger of Dunlane. Yeah, what would that sound like? You smoke crack, don't you? You smoke crack, don't you? Look at me, boy! Don't you smoke crack! Actually, I think it would have been more interesting if, like, Richard Simmons had done the voice. What would that have sounded like? Hey, we're in the Ogre of Dunlane! <laughs> that sounded okay. like rubbing a cheese grater on my nutsack. Well, that's what his voice sounds like to me. Wait, rubbing a cheese grater in your nutsack? Okay, so I just... So this mission that I just completed... The was, most boring mission in Skyrim? No, it's not over. Oh. This part of the mission was to talk to the most boring thing. I thought, find the auger, I thought oh, it would be like a weapon or something like yeah, that. Yeah, yeah. So I go and talk to this blue haze of light that talks more slowly than... Someone who suffered six strokes. No, I wasn't thinking of someone like that. <laughs> talks more slowly than someone uh, with a problem talking really slowly. I and think my joke was funnier. Maybe. And then, <laughs> um, and now my next part of the quest, report to Savos Aren. Great. Report, find, speak, follow, listen. <laughs> it's fucking like... All right, we need some action verbs for this quest line, people. Let's get some action verbs up on the board. Uh, listen. Yeah, that, that's an action verb. Report. <laughs> Technically, that is. I meant like... Fight or destroy or something like that. Uh, uh, talk to. Sp speak with. Uh, uh, Follow. Ask if it's okay. Inquire. Get permission. Be certain. Obviously, the interns designed this quest line. Oh, I gotta go report to Savos. I gotta let him know about everything that's happened. <sighs> He's gonna be so excited. I gotta get up there quick. Epic music. I have important information for you. Really? And what might that be? We need to find the Staff of Magnus. I'm sorry, what? <laughs> I spoke with the auger of Dunlin. Did you really? <laughs> and he specifically mentioned the staff of Magnus? Uh, I don't know, man. I was so <laughs> fucking bored out of my skull. I don't know a single fucking word he said. What should I do next? Impressive attitude. <laughs> yeah. Uh, is there anybody else I can talk to? Completed. Good intestines. Started. Revealing the unseen. Oh god, I can't wait to see what I have to do for this quest. First of all, speak with Mirabelle. Oh uh, well. god, speak with. Hey, did you ever notice how that dragon right there, that skull, <laughs> that dragon bones are just moving around all the time? No, look, just listen to me for a second. Look, look over there. Yeah, right there. No, over there. Right there. 
Right there. No, no, right there. Encano. 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 Yes, right there. You see that? It was moving. I swear it was moving a few seconds ago. If you would have looked then, it would <laughs> you could have seen. You fucking dick. Mirabelle. Hey, baby. Please don't bother the Archmage unless it's absolutely necessary. Shut up. Why do you have to be such a bitch? The only thing about the Staff of Magnus... Why in the world would you be asking? Archmage Aaron said you'd mentioned it recently. I see. I only brought it to his attention a few months back when the Synod showed up here looking for it. Is there any chance you could give me a five or six day long explanation about who the Synod are? <laughs> My understanding is that all they really do is make noise in an attempt to curry favor from the Emperor. Mm, okay. Lots of politics, yeah. little magic. Politics. Oh, Mirabelle. I need to go get drunk. You want to come? <laughs> I bet you'd be pretty fun if you were, had a couple beers in you, Mirabelle. Yeah, she probably gets up on that table, hikes that shit up, takes the cloths off her feet, <laughs> does, some, does some sweet, sexy dancing. So uh, no one knows the staff's location, because I have a staff I could give you the location of. No one here does. If you know what I mean. The Synod seemed convinced it was somewhere in Skyrim. They inquired about the ruins of Mazulft, but that's... Hey, look, there's some guys coming in. I'm going to watch them walk in. That's kind of interesting. They're getting closer. <laughs> Look at them. What are they gonna do? Here they come. Oh my god, what are they doing? Who are these guys? Hey, hey, wh what? <laughs> hey. Oh, it's just you guys. Never mind. <laughs> Let's see what exciting thing you need to do. Find some ruins. That could be exciting. Okay, all that right. That could be good. Finding ruins is a little bit more interesting than speaking with someone. <laughs> That's true. I need you to find the most boring thing in all of Skyrim. It's called the Talking Box. <laughs> All it does is drone on and on all day about things you can do with words like speak and write and order food. It tells you those stories that have no point and just branch off into other stories and never seem to go anywhere. But the trick about the box is, is that there's always a dagger next to it, so at any time you want, you can kill yourself. <laughs> Some men have lasted three days listening to it drone on and on about how fascinating the world is. And how interesting magic and books are. <laughs> so why haven't your parents bought you a horse yet? You know, even even a used one. They just they want me to take time to stop and smell the roses. They could have gone to Jerry Galderson Chevrolet and gotten me one of their fine horses. Yeah. Do do do. What do we got over here? Hey, how's it going? Hey, he has horses. Excuse me, can I join you in the tent for some enjoyment? Wake up. Wow. Yeah, I think that was cool. Did you see that? I've been hunting and fishing in these parts for years. Wow. Oh. Um, I just f used a fireball to kill this wolf. Did you see that? It's not like my poaching is hurting anyone. The Jarl can hardly eat every deer now, can he? I don't... what? <laughs> <laughs> Why don't you just go back to sleep, hun? I'll take care of the business out here. Can I have your horse? I guess I can. Bye! Thanks! Oh, that was awfully nice of those guys. Yeah, they're they're good people. They are good people. Don't really see a whole lot of good people these days. Oh, is that a goat? Oh, God, I gotta get the fuck out of here. Holy <laughs> shit, shit. How, how the fuck do I get out of here? There's a goat. Oh, my God. <sighs> <sighs> that was close. Oh, my God. I thought I was done. That goat almost saw you. Mazulft. Who names these places? You just stay here now. I'm gonna... I'll be right back, okay? You just stay here. No, no, no. No, come... No. I'm gonna... I want to... I'm gonna need you when I come back. Can you stay here? What are you doing? Teach you to run. I asked you to stay here and you wouldn't listen. Yuck, I don't want that. Can that's I go the meat of a traitor. <laughs> yeah, that's the meat of my ex-friend. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so why am I going here? Well, you're going here because you need Staff of Magnus. Yeah. Hey, it's convenient that I just found you here like this, Gavros Plinius. Find Baratus in Oculori. Okay. Ho. Oh. All right, I'll work on that, honey. Hey, spider buddy. You're dead, bitch. <laughs> Fucking chance against my fireball. This place is crazy. What is that? A chorus reaper. Look at it run backwards. Oh, did the Chorus Reaper eat this Synod researcher? That's so disgusting. Oh, the Chorus Reaper doesn't give a shit. Falmer. Suck it. 
Oh, I didn't expect a fourth fireball that would kill me. <laughs> Focusing crystal. Yeah, I think I'm going to need that. You notice that all the farmers kind of look like President George W. Bush? They do. What? What are you doing here? What have you done with Gavros? Your pal Gavros is dead. It was the Falmer, wasn't it? And so is Davros, who invented the Daleks, actually. Oh, I'm looking for the staff of Magnus just to get right down to business. Well, I'm afraid I can't help you with that. Okay. I need the crystal to do anything useful, and I don't have it. Mm, well, I've got it. You found? Yeah. How in the world? I just killed this dude and he had it. I'm with the College of Winterhold. You are, are you? Yes. We have very nice asses at the College of Winterhold. <laughs> we also are very interested in speaking and discussing and talking and following. If you want me to do something like that, I can definitely- Yes, I will follow you. I'm very good at this. In fact, he has a major in following. I do. I have a major in following and a minor in attempting to kill myself. <laughs> Because I'm so bored all the time. It's more of an extracurricular but, activity. But, you know, it's hard to get a degree in killing yourself out of boredom. I wish one of these quests would just be like, have sex with one of your college roommates. <laughs> come on. I mean, come on. Like, magical sex. Where you use magic to make your dick, like, 17 inches long. Why stop at 17? Why not go into uh, the... Once you start getting any longer than that, it's gonna get <laughs> awkward, you know? Oh, oh shit. Fuck. Look at what we got here. It's your first multiple choice test of college. It is. It's like a pop quiz. Oh my god, that took forever. Well, it didn't, it didn't take that long. It's only it's only been like a half an hour, Emery. <sighs> I don't know what your problem is. I can't help but think, but we might have got that done quicker if we weren't drunk. Hey, dickweed, how's it going? Is it? What have you done? You better fuck off. So, the staff of Magnus is somewhere else that I have to go fucking look for. Well, yes. You're kidding me. But that doesn't matter now, because I know you're hoarding something even more important at your college. I am. I have over. I have a collection of over 30 skulls. <laughs> I'd like to add your skull to my collection. You got what you need. Ho ho! No, you don't yield. You die. Fucking dick. I killed him. I killed him. Do Yay. do do do. He was a douchebag. I'm so glad he's dead. What the fuck? Hello. Oh, these guys again. But what? Trying times are ahead. Oh hi. Is it snowing where you live? <laughs> Cause it looks like it is here. You are on the right path, and you will prevail. Path or path? <sighs> I don't know what a path is. Is that like a posse? Bye. Oh, Mazulft, I'm gonna miss you. Are you? No. Did you just let one? I let one. Wonderful. You know, wherever I see that statue of the mage farting, I just feel like I need to. Hey, what's happening? Uh, sorry I'm late. I've been drinking. I don't know what he's doing, but he won't get I'm away. I'm kind of wasted right now, so I can't really hear you. Savos, I love you. I love all you guys at the Mages College. You guys are so awesome. I'm so glad I came here. Hey, what are you doing, man? Oh, you're supposed to blast it. Blast what? it! What? Whatever, man. Just do it. I did it. Hey, what are you doing, dude? Maybe you should stop. That's the guy with the nice butt. Check it out. Yeah! Hey, buddy, you better stop it. Stop it, man. They're coming for you. Stop it. Get him. Ah, shit. Uh... What's going on? Are you all right? N no. Can you walk? Yeah. I need you on your feet. We're in trouble here. I'm kind of tired. <laughs> I think I might take a nap. Oh man, that's not oh, good. Oh no, Savos! I'm eating banana, sorry. Savos is dead, oh god! But he was the dean! Now who's going to stop your crazy college antics? No one. <laughs> <laughs> hey Feraldi, you wanna go protect the village and shit? Should be fun. Come on, Feralda. I like you. You're my favorite here. You're no Astrid, but if I gotta bang somebody... Hey, Feralda. Have you ever been a part of a gangbang? <laughs> it's pretty fun. You wanna try it? Me and Arniel. How about it? <laughs> Just the three of us. Threesome? Come on. If you've never tried it, it's pretty fun. 
That's right. the look of consideration. Yeah, she is. She'll think about it. She'll let me know. All Defeat right. the creatures investing in Winterhold. All right, if you insist. Man, these things sure have a lot of health. Yeah, punch him. Punch him. Whoops, set my buddy on fire there. <laughs> Woo! We did it. Good job, everybody. Hey, how do you want to celebrate, Ferelda? How about a little party? I'm having a party back in my dorm room right now. Do you want to come? To celebrate killing all these guys? Hey, hey! <laughs> Shit. <laughs> I, guess I shouldn't have asked her. Now what? Hello? Can I come in? I just want to talk to you for a second, man. God, why are you such a dick? Hey, I uh, took care of those dudes out in the uh, town. What? Did, get over here. Well, is everything out there all right? Yeah, it's fine. Wish I could say the same for us. Yeah, me too. Tolfdir and I can try and keep this contained. Can you? You need to get your hands on the staff of Magnus. Now. Okay, well, I guess I'll go off to Labyrinthian. What? Are you... are you sure? No, I'm not sure. I don't want to go there. I want to go back to my dorm room and have a nap and drink a booze. What are you doing here? You need to get that staff or else we don't stand a chance. Uh, okay, but where are you shouting at me from? <laughs> oh, there he is. Jesus, he just... Were you in this pool? What are you doing here? What are you doing here? I'm just a student. Yeah. Shouldn't you be out doing something? Why don't you go get the goddamn staff? I'm just fucking... I came here to learn how to do magic. Oh. Not to save the college. <laughs> He's like, don't worry. I'll keep your chair nice and warm while you go save the world. What are you doing here? You need to get that staff or else we don't... Yeah. Yeah, get out of your room. I'm using it and go find that staff. <laughs> you fucking loser. Give oh. me one good reason I shouldn't destroy you. Get away from me. <laughs> God, sorry, Tilf, dear. Oh, wow. This is my room. Get out of here. <laughs> what are you doing here? We gotta get out and go get that staff. What are you doing here? You gotta go get out and get, get that staff. What's upstairs? I've never, I've up never been up here. Hey, who's this? What am I doing here? I'm supposed to be getting the staff and saving the college. This is going to be terrible for business. This is going to be terrible for business. What am I doing here? I'm supposed to get that staff. This is going to be terrible for business. <laughs> this is terrible for business. What am I doing here? I have to go get that staff and get save the college. If we can't stop this, what happens to the rest of Skyrim? That would be bad for business. <laughs> oh my god. I'm going to kill myself if I stay here any more longer. I'm going to go get that fucking staff and save the college. What the hell? This is the College of Winterhold's mascot. S mascot. <laughs> Bored face. <laughs> I guess we just got to do this. Yeah, let's go to Labyrinthian. That'll be really fun, right? Mm-hmm. It's not like it's going to be long and boring and hard to navigate. No, 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 no. Ugh, if only Astrid was sending me out to kill people. It just doesn't get any more exciting than that. No, it doesn't. We really um, blew our load right away. We did. We blew it all over Astrid's face. Hello? Savos? Wow, this is, his ghost travels quick. Huh. Hey, what's going on, man? Nothing? Okay, well, <laughs> fuck you. All right, this is kind of labyrinthian in here. Labyrinthian? L labyrinthian. Labyrinthian. Librarian. Labrizzle. Manizzle. Wow. Hey, what's happening? Oh, oh my sweet. god, there's a fucking skeleton dragon. Oh my god, this is way more exciting than it should be. <laughs> this is impossible. Impossibly exciting. Oh god. Oh shit, I got trouble. Jeez. Nice. Yeah, you piece of shit. You like that? Well, that was pretty cool. I was not expecting anything exciting at all. <laughs> oh, shit. Hello? Oh, that's the mascot. Right there. See it? That's Board Face. Board Face, the mascot. That was where Savos got the idea for him as a mascot. Oh, right. Hey, look out. There's a fireball. Look out, man. Oh, God! <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why, but those slow motion deaths really get me giggling. Yeah, they make me kind of feel pleasured. Check it out. Hey, thanks for finding me. I love you. Can you take me somewhere where there's a lot more skulls, where I can hang out, and people can come and sit on me without asking permission? Yes, of course, Skull. I can do that. Thank you. You're welcome. Nern root alert. Nern root alert. Nern root alert. All senior citizens should have Nern root alert. Whoa. Uh, oh, God. Dumbass alert. I've fallen, and I my Nern root alert <laughs> went off. <laughs> hey, that guy's uh, he's on a treadmill. <laughs> a little Draugr White treadmill. I've heard they're pretty good. Gotta keep that spectral heart rate up. 
spectral heart rate. That's what my doctor said the other day. Mm -hmm. After he gave you your colonoscopy? No, he didn't. He said when I'm 40, though, I have to get a colonoscopy. <laughs> and I'm not 40, so... <laughs> Emery went to his doctor and was like, uh, I think I need a colonoscopy. And the doctor was like, no, you don't need that until you're 40. And Emery was like, no, I, I crammed so many CDs up my ass. <laughs> CDs. <laughs> yeah, you're right. Cramming CDs up your ass is a lot worse than cramming fucking eight tracks up your ass. Like exactly. I'm sure you were doing. Yeah, eight tracks. Good one. Actually, I was cramming um, oral storytelling up my ass because I'm so old. <laughs> hey, everybody, what's going on? What are you guys doing? That's weird. What are you doing? Maroki. Morakai. Maroki. Who says it's Maroki? I do. Why would it be pronounced Maroki? That's really stupid. Yeah, well, he's really stupid. Okie dokie, Maroki. Oh, that was too easy. Yeah, what a loser. What a fat Lame. loser. <gasps> Staff of Magnus, I don't want that. Uh, <laughs> I guess I'll take this and, uh, yeah, that should be good. Wait. <sighs> Staff of Magnus, that sounds familiar. I remember everybody at the college getting their undies in a bundle about something. Yeah, it was gonna be bad for business or some shit like I that. I thought that was called, like, the Staff of... Shag nuts. <laughs> shag nuts. Well, I better take this one just in case, I guess. But we still have to find the staff of shag nuts. <laughs> All right, return to Tolfdir. Oh, God. I was having so much fun until return to Tolfdir came on the screen. What? Who's that? Oh, it's Ancano! No, is it? Oh, this is a storm. This is not Ancano. <laughs> it's Ancano's twin brother. I'm afraid I'll have to take that stuff from you now. What should I kill him with? How should I dispatch him? You could use one of your staffs. Those should I cool. use the oh, staff okay. of Magnus? Oh, that'd be awesome. Be like, oh, oh, wait, th this staff? Hey, Stormo. Yeah. See you later, shithead. Awesome. You look pretty cool now with that uh, mask. I do, on. don't I? Check this out. Oh, yeah. You look like Iron Man. I look like a frog boy. No, you know what you uh. look like? You look bored. Yeah, that's true. I do look. You know what? This is an accurate representation of what I'm feeling right now. <laughs> the game has finally found the mask for me. Okay, I gotta go back to the... Oh, no. <laughs> hey, Tolfter. Hey, this isn't as boring as I thought it was gonna be. <laughs> hey, everybody. Come on, let's go study. Stop all this foolishness. <laughs> Tolfter. What's going on, man? You survived. Yeah, of course I did. Where's Mirabelle? <laughs> when the hell did I start caring about that jerk? <laughs> Where's that angry bitch that always, like, <laughs> reprimanded me? <laughs> uh, Wor she worried about her. <laughs> Seems like she'd be out here. <laughs> what the fuck? What, uh, what are you doing out here, man? It looks like it's pretty normal in there. Why don't we just go in? Ancano's power snack. is growing. We can't crack Oh, Ancano? Oh, who cares? Oh, that guy. Hey, Tolftir. Uh, okay, yeah, let's get inside, quick. Oh, God. Oh. Oh, shit. Oh, uh, bye, Tolfdeer. <laughs> Did you see that? He just fell off the bridge. I'll be amazed. Yeah, me too. Especially Tolfdeer. <laughs> <laughs> I gotta stop off in my room, everybody. I, uh, you know, gotta go tinkle. Oh, time to drop off some skulls. Yeah, I have a little delivery to make here. All right, well, I just finished dropping off my Lowe's skulls, so I guess it's time to head out and then... What the... <laughs> Holy <laughs> shit! <laughs> Tolfter's back and he's pissed! Holy How shit! How did you make it back, man? We must hurry if we're going to defeat Ancano. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dude. I love you. Tolfter's like, yeah, you can fucking knock me three miles off of a cliff. I'll be back in like 20 seconds. <laughs> what, now are you gonna fist fight? <laughs> I thought you had the flames out before. <laughs> He does look pretty friggin' ridiculous. I think he used to be a pugilist in his earlier days. <laughs> and now he's just insane. Fights for money. All right, man. Well, I like your attitude. Let's do this. <laughs> Ancano, you don't stand a chance. <laughs> now nah, I was Tolfdeer's fists and my skulls. You think I can't destroy you? I don't uh -huh. think so, no. Power to unmake the world at my fingertips. Uh -huh. And you think you can do anything about it? Oh, I don't know, I guess. Maybe. <laughs> Holy shit. Dude, relax. Why did you do that? I think he might have hit his head on the way down. <laughs> I think something bad did happen to him. Uh-oh. Whoa, what did he just do? Oh, shit. Did you just kill Tolfdeer? Whoa. Dude, thank you. Oh, my God. He's fucking already rigor mortized. <laughs> what, are you trying to fist fight me? What a loser. <laughs> Tolfdeer. Sudden, sudden obsession with pugilism around here. What's he got now? Oh, just a bunch of crap. Gross, I wish I wouldn't have done that. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs>
So uh, what do we do now? You want to go play uh, Pushy Off the Cliffy? A little bit more? I don't know. <laughs> oh, come on. He's got mixed feelings about yeah, that. I think he kind of enjoyed it. Speak with Yellow Nuts. Your victory here justifies our belief in you. I'm here to wrap things up in the most boring way possible. Just wanted to let you know that we love you. If you ever need anything, whores, money, <laughs> some coffee, I'll give it to you. What do we do now? The eye has grown unstable. It must be secured. Onkano's actions prove that the world is not ready for such a thing. Oh. We shall safeguard it. Okay. For now. You just go ahead and take it. So, yeah, you... you <laughs> it's all yours, man. Just okay. like these guys have the... Yeah, I trust this guy. Why not? You've done it. The college is safe again thanks to your work. Oh, yeah. There's no one more deserving to be Archmage, in my opinion. What, me? <laughs> Who, me? So, does this mean that you graduated? I guess. Are you actually gonna give me, like, a hat or something? Diploma, maybe? <laughs> no, it's just like, yeah, you're the Archmage. Uh, everybody else is pretty much dead or <laughs> stupid. So, I really think Tolfdir would be a better Archmage than me. You'd think. He finds all this shit fascinating. <laughs> whereas, I do not. <laughs> Ooh, all spells cost 15% less to cast. Oh plus 50. My God. This is my diploma. Hi, I'm the Archmage. Do you like it here at my college? Wait, I can take her as my companion? Ooh. Berlena Marion, maybe you and I have a future. Lead the way. Oh yeah, now we're talking. Let's go talk to Enther. Let's see if everything's bad for business still. Okay. <laughs> hey, Enther! Enther, everything should be good for business now, right, friend? Um, I'm the Archmage, and you have something of Anman's, and he wants it back. Oh my. I'm the Archmage. How precious. It's in everyone's best interest if you return the amulet, Persuade. I'm not concerned with everyone's best interest. I find I'm only concerned with my own. I'm the Archmage. Look how persistent you are. Yeah, I'm the Archmage. People just, uh, I don't get any respect. No. I showed up at college. Seven days later, I'm the Archmage. <laughs> Come on, give me some fucking respect here, people. Look, I traded a staff to someone and found out later that was a bad idea, so I'd like the staff back. I'll get the fucking staff for you. Finally, we have an agreement. Yeah. The agreement is I get the staff, and then I stick it all the way up your butt. <laughs> Great, we have a deal. Did you see that? I'm the Archmage, and he just fucking treated me like a turd. I need you to do something. All right, what is it? You see him? Get him. You Can't never need that. something. Sorry. Especially what? I told you to attack him. I'm the Archmage. I'm the Archmage, bitch. Anything else? Jesus. No. No, if you're not going to do what I tell you to do, then what's the point? Yeah. If you can't get people to kill other people for no reason, what's the point of being oh, the Archmage? What a nightmare. Fuck this. I got to get the staff for this sack of shit. I hate this college so much. I don't want to live in it. I can't take this anymore. Here we go. I don't end it all! Oh, God. I couldn't even kill myself. I thought that was going to be so great. They'd be like, oh, the, the new Archmage, he, he jumped off the edge of the building. Our hiring process really just seems flawed. Especially if the new Archmage, as soon as he's made Archmage, jumps off a cliff. That's, that's bad for business. Well, I guess I should just rush back up and run over to Tulfdir and he'll be like, Wow, I thought you committed suicide. <laughs> You're like, nope, I'm just as cool as you, man. <laughs> I wonder how many children, when they were growing up, their parents were like, What do you want to be, Billy, when you grow up? When I grow up, I want to be the archmage of a college and have everyone treat me like nothing. Whoa, hey, what's happening, man? I just want to hang out. I'm the archmage of this college. You want to come and be a part of it? It's pretty fun. <laughs> We'll cast some spells, we'll have a few beers, maybe we'll- Never mind. Why don't they ever listen? I think you need to work on your recruitment strategies. <laughs> hey, anybody want to join the College of Winterfell? In seven days, you can be the Archmage. How about you, Ascendant it Necromancer? <laughs> oh. Ow. Hey. I guess I should have just sent them a pamphlet in the mail. <laughs> <laughs> Nobody <laughs> likes it when you just show up at their house. No! Shalador's Insights. Hey, those are the writings you need. Hooray! Oh, what? I gotta talk to you, Rag. That was stupid. 
first recruitment attempt, a failure. <laughs> but I feel like Befralia and I learned something about each other. We learned that we both like to cast Flame Matronax. So we've got something in common. Yeah. We could. This could develop into something good. A serious relationship, perhaps? Look at that. What? A cave. Who knows what could be down there? Uh. Okay. <laughs> I've just suddenly lost interest in you completely. You've got the most beautiful bloodshot... Sickly eyes. Saggy. Oh my god. Was I really just talking about a relationship with <laughs> Brelena? Oh, you must have been drunk. <laughs> oh my god, I don't know what came over me. Wow, you did you get hurt? Do you have a concussion? <laughs> Alright, we need to go back to the college, hun. I'm gonna get you back to the college right away. This might be it for her as my companion. <laughs> <laughs> Say one stupid thing and you're done. Yeah, one strike and you're out. <laughs> Drevis Naloran? Who the hell's that? You... You can see me? Uh, I'm the Archmage. Is there any college business that I, the Archmage, can assist with? There may be a matter in which your skills could be useful. The various points of focus... Uh, we're having a conversation, <laughs> buddy. Go look for your toupee, loser. We're busy. Yeah, okay, I'll help. I'm only the Archmage. Cleanse the focal points. That's a new set of adjectives and nouns. <sighs> Cleanse the fucking... Okay, he just asked me to go be the fucking janitor. Is this a class? <laughs> is this what classes are at this school? Are you in this class? <laughs> what are you doing here? Uh, hey, can somebody clean this up, please? <laughs> He's just lying here naked. This college is a fucking nightmare. <laughs> Everyone's a fucking lunatic. <laughs> this is all a big trick, isn't it? Archmage is actually not the leader of the school. He's the janitor. <laughs> They've made me the official janitor of the school, and they just call, oh yeah, you're the Archmage, yeah, yeah. Uh, go cleanse these focal points. Um, now go clean out the uh, uh, magical toilets. I'll take what I can get. Shut up. I found more of Shalador's work. <laughs> Excellent. I'll start translating it. Shouldn't take me more than a day or two. Uh, have you made any progress since two seconds ago? I only just got my hands on it. I can only work so quickly. Hurry up. The nerve of that guy. Are you paying attention? Berlena, over here. Yeah. <laughs> All right, let's head out. Berlena definitely has a head injury of some sort. <laughs> Did you see the way she was staring off in the distance? Like, I don't even exist. <laughs> wow. Hey, Berlena, you want to come and get in the bed? Look, it's a double bed, can honey. You, can you command her to sleep in the bed? I want you to sleep in this bed and have sex with me. Okay, got it. Oh, yeah, here we go. Here we go. Okay, now I'm going to sleep in bed, too. Okay, got it. But, no, I said... Boy, sex is really complicated in Skyrim. <laughs> there you go. Yeah, I got her, I got her. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Oh, yeah. Oh, you were magnificent. We heading out? Yeah, you want to make some eggs? I'll just be here then. No, can you go make some eggs? There's that head injury yeah. again. <laughs> Showed uh, itself. I did take advantage of a girl with a head injury. I, I feel a little bad. Oh. But, you know, you got to get what you can at this college. <laughs> I'd like to see you go to, like, a bar and try and pick up some chicks. Yeah, I'm, I'm the Archmage of the College of Winterhold. It's no big deal, you know, I just uh, cleanse focal points and uh, <laughs> fetch books. Pick up dead bodies. Talk to people. You know, Archmage stuff. It's pretty cool. Hey, uh, do you have a head injury? <laughs> 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 oh, so these are the things that need cleaning. Uh, I guess I gotta wear the Mystic Tuning Gloves. I'm pretty sure this is actually like a piss pot that I just cleaned. <laughs> Take With these, uh, you know... Mystical gloves. The, and clean the Mystic... Focal point. Why does it smell like shit? <laughs> yeah. What's that weird smell coming out of this? <laughs> no, that's the smell of magic. Well, is that what Raw magic smells magic. like? You know, if you turn this statue around and had him point the other direction, he, <laughs> he was blasting out his ass right at this. <laughs> I think there's a connection there. Oh, oh, shit, a dragon. Come and get me. How'd you miss? It was hard. It was very hard. Nice. Pest exterminated. Hey, uh, can somebody clean this? Oh, it's me, isn't it? That's your job. I have to clean this. Ugh. Ugh, man. Stinky. Yeah! <laughs> I 
took a little effort, but uh, I got him out of there. You got to take pride in your work. Your uh, focal points have been uh, cleansed. Yes, they have. I can feel the difference already. Yeah. Uh, of course, mm, me too. 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 Can you clean my focal points now, please? <laughs> All right. Uh, where is my companion? You told her to go make eggs and then left. <laughs> <laughs> I did. I'm such an asshole. She's old news now that we've done it. Morvath's Morvath Slayer. Slayer. Oh, it's too bad. Uh, what's her name isn't here? She'd be like, there's a cave here. Who knows what's inside? Oh, we're in a vampire's cave here, Ooh. it looks like. How exciting. Where's the party? Hey, uh, dudes, I uh, heard there was a party in here. Cool, let's party. Oh, shit. Whoa. Well, they must have had quite a party in here. <laughs> yeah, they're all passed out. Hey, we don't have any vampires at the college. You guys uh, ever think about joining a magic college? Let me show you some of the things you can learn at the College of Magic. You can learn such spells as fireball. Double-fisted fireball. <laughs> ball of fire. Flaming ball. Sphere of flames. And then, if you're of Mexican heritage... Ball del Fuego. <laughs> Grand Staff of Charming. Oh, I already have one of those. <laughs> <laughs> oh, ho, ho. I crack Ooh. myself up. Oh, yeah, the Staff of Charming. I'll go give that to Enther the douchebag. I'm quite pleased that we're back to business as usual. Yeah, I bet you're pleased. I did that, you know. You could have done me a fucking favor and not made me go find this staff halfway across the world. But no, you're just like, no, go find it, you douchebag archmage. Here's your staff, you fucking asshole. Now I'd like the amulet, you fucking asshole, please, fucking asshole. Pleasure doing business with you. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> you're such an asshole. Hey, wake the fuck up, Anman. I got your stupid Thanks shit. To you, the people of Skyrim will continue to have a place to study magic, even if most of them resent you for it. What? Why do they resent me for it? Here's your stupid amulet, you bitch. Oh, I didn't think he'd really give it back. Thank you, friend. Yeah, he didn't. I had to go travel across the world to get him something to trade for it. I'd better get going. Yeah, you better get going. Okay, Douche. check this out. I'd better get going. <laughs> <laughs> Shh, fucking goes to bed. What a yeah, dick. yeah, you know, I'm right in the middle of something. Hold on. Yeah, I gotta let you go. What a jerk. <laughs> okay, dude. I put like 70 skulls in there. First of all, what are you doing in my room? <laughs> what are I'm you gonna, doing that for? Because you're sitting in my chair. Look at that. He was just sitting on all my skulls. <laughs> what the hell's wrong with They're you? They're probably all crushed. Now sit down, loser. Come on, go ahead. No, please. Be my guest. <laughs> Wait a minute. Is that just Argo? Oh, let's see him sit. What? Okay. Here. Feel free. Here. Have another one. <laughs> Here. There you go. Why don't you just have some more? Take all my skulls, please. I don't care. Whoa. It's like part of him now. Jesus, what a weirdo. Whoa! Yeah, just throw them all over the place. I don't care. Gajita, not known as mages. Shut up. Shut up. Oh, yeah. This is where I live. This is not bad. Yeah, it's okay. I think there's more in this world for crotch guzzle than just being... The Archmage Janitor. <laughs> hey, look who's waiting for me yeah. at my bed. We heading out? Uh, no, I need you to do something. All right, what is it? Oh, I think you know what it is. <laughs> <laughs> okay, got it. Yeah, let's do it. It's a fine day with you around. Well, thank you. She wants it. She always wants it. She does. But she's dumb as a doorknob. Yeah. You know, you're great, Berlina, but um, I, I think, think my parents reserved a spot for me here at the college on the day I was born. I'm sure they did. And you can stay here because I'm leaving. Um, <laughs> you and I, uh, you know, it's what the fuck? <laughs> I was trying to break up with her and she just like took off. Uh, Berlina, listen to me for a second. <laughs> Interested in me, are you? Well, yes. Why wouldn't I be? Are you interested in me? Uh, no. Oh. I'm sorry I said anything then. Yeah. <laughs> Actually, uh, we're breaking up. Uh, Berlina, come here. Berlina, uh, it's not you, it's me. Uh, I'm moving on. I'm going somewhere else now. I don't want to be the Archmage at this college anymore. Um, you're really disgusting and ugly. Sex with you is like having sex with a dead animal. And... <laughs> Uh, I don't know. I I'm trying to be polite here. Um, so well, we're done. We're finished, Berlina. I need to find someone different. Someone 
Not you. I'd better get going. Okay. It was nice fucking you. Okay, <laughs> These college breakups are so weird and hard, mm. you know? I just did, I don't know what to say. I think you handled that one well. I, I, th I guess so. It was my first real breakup, so I don't know. I hope she'll be all right. You know, Emery, I graduated from college. I became the Archmage. That was my graduation. Yeah. You know, I mean, there's nothing left to do, really. I'm just, like, I cleaned up the place. I broke up with my girlfriend. It's time for me to move on. There is one thing you still have to do. What's that? Graduation party. Yeah. I need a party. And I think that I know where the party is. Ooh, party in the big city. Yeah. To get to this party, I have to go through uh, some some bullshit, but it's going to be a good party. Oh, you know, like RSVPing and, you know, buying the booze? Yeah, and... you know, I got to talk to the right people and, you know, I got to make sure I can get in to okay. a good party. Gotcha. I don't want just, I don't want just like any party. I want like a really upper crust cool party. So let's see. I think I got to talk to this guy. Need something? Yes, I need to talk to you, Malborn. Our mutual friend, uh, J Jimmy Lumpkin sent me. Really? <laughs> yep. You know who she picked? Oh, I mean, uh, Jenny Lumpkin. <laughs> what kind of things should I bring? You're asking me? To the party. Yeah, you look like a partier. I bring whatever you need to move quietly and kill quickly. Huh. What kind of a party is this? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I've been to one of these parties. See, when he says kill, he means, like, kill, like, uh, social. Oh, like I have to be dressed to kill. Yeah, absolutely. Okay, I get it. You ready yet? Uh, no, I just have to go get a nice outfit for the party. I'll be back. I need something really sexy for a party. What do you got? Breeches, gowns, clothes for any occasion, really. Gross. Where's the Nasty. party outfit? How about like a toga? That'd be cool. These boots are kind of nice. Ooh. College robes. Fuck no. He's I'm, the archmage. I'm so done with college. I'm the archmage. Check me out. Mmm. Yeah. This is good party wear. What I've got here, I'm good. I'm ready to go. You ready yet? I need to get back before I missed. Okay, I'm ready. Oh, you gotta give him whatever you want him to, like, smuggle in for you. I wanna have a fun time at this party. How about this? Can he take this? Uh, yeah. Maybe he should take these in for me. Okay, just in case. Oh, what else do I need? Do you have, like, a beer bong? That'd be fun. I got a basket. You do? <laughs> I'm gonna make sure he takes this basket. Okay. <laughs> make sure that basket gets to the party. I'm gonna need that. Uh, it was nice meeting you, Malborn. Yeah. Hmm. Wow. <laughs> Quite the personality, that guy. Have you given Malborn the gear you want to smuggle into the embassy? Yeah, yeah, I took care of it. Oh, yeah. This is it, baby. Woo! You're moving up in the world. I'm going to celebrate my graduation from college in style. Put this on. Party boots? Party clothes? Ah. Oh. I didn't need to buy any of that shit. Why'd you waste my time, asshole? I didn't know she was going to give you clothes. God damn it. Okay, chicken, check this shit out. Look at me. Yeah, I'm ready for a party. You like that? Oh, shit, he loves it. <laughs> well, I'm glad I have your approval. I'm ready, Delphine. Keep the rest of my things safe for me, okay? Party time, excellent. Crotch Guzzler's world, party time, excellent. Party on, Crotch. Party on, bitch. This is where the party is. I can't wait, this is gonna be so fun. Is he wearing the same shirt as me? Oh, thank God. Oh my God. Actually, if you had shown up with your other outfit. Oh my God, I'm so glad I didn't wear that other shirt. It would have been the same as Razalan. <laughs> This is gonna be a fun party. Hope there's some hot chicks here. Yeah. Oh, shit. Welcome. Hi. I don't believe we've met. No, we haven't. I am Ellen Wynn. My name is Crotch Guzzler. Pleased to meet you. Ah, uh, yes. I remember your name from the guest list. I'm surprised. Yes. Which part stuck out the most, Crotch or Guzzler? Hey, Malborn, do you have my stuff? Let's hope we both live through this day. Oh, yeah, me too. This is gonna be a good party, right, buddy? <laughs> uh, mm. wow. There's like two people at this party. <laughs> well, you know, the night is still young. Maybe everyone else is just fashionably late. Who's the most eligible lady at this party? Hey, baby. Are you a lady? It looks like it. Yeah, those are boobs. We're not supposed to talk to the guests. Oh, well, uh, you're no fun. Oh, hey, let's talk to that blonde chick right there. Oh, my God. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> uh... Wow, okay, so far, the ladies at this party, not super exciting. Ild Ooh. Ildi! Hello! These parties are a great way to earn a little extra money. You're not a guest, are you? I'm the Archmage. I hope you're enjoying the music, sir. No, no, you stopped playing. <sighs> hey, there's a fine piece of ass sitting down eating some bread. Uh, okay, what did you just say, Emery? Oh, God! 
Yeah. This Never is, mind. This is what you said with a fine piece of ass. She looks better from far away. There are words spoken and words unspoken. I wish I had unspoken those words. <laughs> it's too late. Oh, Do you know, is there any women, like, hidden away in, uh, behind the walls or something? The Great War the is long past. It's time oh to God! This guy just wants to talk about politics. What are you looking at? Stop staring at me! Oh, he's checking you out. Well, you know what? He's a lot hotter than any of the women at this party. <laughs> this is the worst party I've ever been to. <laughs> Whose idea was it to come to this pile of shit? Do enjoy yourself. I won't. You didn't invite anyone that's fun to party with. This is the shittiest party I've ever been to. Where's the beer? Come on, give me some booze. Oh my God! What? Apple pie? What kind of a fucking party is this? <laughs> Give me some of this. I hope you're enjoying yourself. Hey, what happened to the... <laughs> I'd like a drink. Here you go, sir. Colombian brandy. Colombian brandy? Wow, I didn't know they had that. I'd like another drink. I'm sorry, but I think you've had enough for them. No, moment. no, I haven't. No more. Oh, God. I'm what kind of party does anybody say, I'm sorry, but you've had enough? Yeah, after one drink. Yeah. <laughs> like, yep, yeah, one drink at this party and you're done. Fuck Pl this party. Who wants this fucking sweet roll? Fuck you guys. I'm wasted. I had that one drink. It was too much for me. I don't know what's happening anymore. Oh, oh God. I'm so wasted. Oh, God, this party's so dull. Oh, <laughs> oh yeah, I'm gonna dance on this table. Woo! Yeah, Raven Crown, come and dance with me. Come on, baby. Come on. Here. Have some fucking bread. Have some more <laughs> bread. Have some more bread, you piece of shit. You like bread? Eat it. Eat it. Eat this bread. Eat it. Suck it. Oh, she takes out her own bread. She doesn't <laughs> like my bread. She's got to eat her own bread. Screw you. I hate all of you. Let's get out of here. Want to ditch this place? What does a fellow need to do to get a drink around here? Yeah, that's a good question. They only gave me one. Here, you can have mine. Ah, the one generous soul amongst a gathering of pinch pennies and lick spittle. Yeah, there is a lot of lick spittles here. <laughs> I noticed that immediately. <laughs> you know, actually, there is something you can do for me. Uh, I need you to cause a scene, maybe burn some things, uh, you know, light this guard on fire. Um, you know, stab some people. Is that all? Yep. <laughs> My friend, you've come to the right person. Yeah, do it, buddy. Come on. Get some excitement going at this party. All right, well, I'm blowing this party. This is a fucking joke. I'm out of here. <laughs> let's go. Let's go. All right, let's go, Malborn. I guess me and Malborn are gonna get it on. Oh, thank God, my basket. <laughs> <laughs> All right, now it's time for a real party. Yeah, now let's start the party right. Hey, what's happening? Oh, excuse me. Whoops. Oh, yeah, now this party's more fun. Now there's some people on fire. I see, well, I just summoned my own fun. <laughs> Crotch Guzzler's fame, Adronach. Yeah, dance for me, dance. You know what they say, if there isn't a hot chick at the party, make one yourself. That's what they said in Weird Science. <laughs> <laughs> Check this out! Yeah. That does a lot of damage I when it hits. I stormed his ice. Yeah. Now we're talking. Ain't a real party until you get in a fight. Okay, where do I have to go? Down in some sort of basement. Oh, this must be where the real party is. Yeah, I see. That was just a front. Everybody was old. You know what it was? That was the party for the real guest's parents. Ah, yeah. right. So down here is where there's going to be all kinds of writhing maidens and club music and... Torture devices. Torture devices. Blood. Oh, this is not where the party is. Hey, uh, what's happening? I told you. I don't know anything else about it. Where is the party? Tell me where the fucking party is, Etienne Rarness. What? The Who? party. What? All right, fine. Tell you what, I'm going to let you go, but then you have to tell me where a cool party is. Yeah, sure. Hey, stop it. Is, is that dude okay? He's fine, see? Let's go to that party. You said you'd tell me. <laughs> he looks a little upset. Uh, Rarness. Hey, Rarness, what are you doing? <laughs> Where are you going? You said you'd tell me. Oh, Jesus, he thinks I attacked him. Wait, is that is that your friend? Oh, shit, Malborn! Oh! No. Oh no, they killed you! No, he's just passed out. Oh yeah, you're right, he got really drunk, I bet. Yeah, he must have had that second no, drink there's that no he way. wasn't supposed well, to have. He must have stole it then, because that was the only way to get it. Alright, Malborn, come on. We gotta... This is disgraceful, just leaving you at the top of the stairs like that here. Oh. 
<laughs> there we go. That's more like it. Uh, Emery, I think we just found the party. Is this a rave? This guy is really good at breakdancing. Check this shit out. Wow, I can't even tell what he's doing. He's that quick. I wonder if we can find some Fusro dubstep. <laughs> Fusro dubstep. <laughs> Well, that party was really dumb. Some pretty cool dubstepping going on, but like besides that, I mean, one drink, one <laughs> drink. Usually it's a one drink minimum. Yeah, they have a one drink maximum at that fucking party. Those people have no tolerance. None. It must be elves. High elves have like a half a drink and they're totally <laughs> off their ass. That was the one thing about The Lord of the Rings that bothered me, was when Legolas was able to fucking outdrink Gimli. Uh, that was a little stupid. But elves apparently have magical livers yeah. that can absorb <laughs> endless amounts of alcohol. Yeah, it's, it's, it's that magical organ that allows them to walk on fucking snow without, <laughs> right, you know, exactly. bothering it. Fuck this. Time to get some drinks. I'm going to go to the Bannered Mare, and I'm going to have more than one drink. All right, I need a drink. What do you got for me, honey? You look like someone who can hold their liquor. Excuse me? How about a friendly contest to win a staff? Uh, are you suggesting I participate in a drinking contest with you, Sam Guinevere? <laughs> Wait a minute, it said, Gw like, Guinevere up there, and it says Guivine right down here. It was different. His name was different. No, it no, wasn't. No, it was. It was. Check this out. Sam Guinevere. Okay. What? And yet, he's telling me his name is Sam Guivine. Guivin. Sam Guivine. Guinevere or Guivine? What is it? Maybe you just aren't up to the challenge. Okay, I really do need a drink now. Let's do this. You need a drink until his name makes sense. Yeah, exactly. I wonder how many more times it'll change. A drinking contest? You don't stand a chance, my friend, because I can drink upwards of two beverages. This is a special brew. Very strong stuff. Mm. Let's get started. All right. I'll start round one. Down the hatch. Oh, they've started the drums in the background. This, this is exciting. Your turn. Okay. You should find somebody to do body shots off of. Yeah, let's do body shots off of Sam Guinevere. One down, my friend. Yeah. One down. Yeah, that's enough. Cut me off. And another one for me. Cut me off. I've had too many. It's an ode to Skyrim's staunch protectors, the Imperials. Shut up. Good job, man. You missed it. What if he didn't even take that drink? Oh, God, I'm so wasted. I'm not paying attention. <laughs> A second drink. Are you crazy? So says you. I think I've hit my limit on these things. Really? Tell you what. One more and you win the contest. Okay. One more. No problem-ish. Wow. You've really done it. Yes, I drank three beers. Nice. Can you believe that shit? Uh, I'm looking for a thash grape. Do you have any of that kind of fruit? No, no, no. You don't understand. You're, you're drunk and you're oh, slurring I'm drunk? your words. Oh, After three. I don't think so. I I do a show called Beer and Board Games, Sam, so I would never be drunk after three beers. Hey, you don't look so good. Well, what just happened? I don't wake know. up. What the fuck? That's right. It's time to wake up, you drunken blasphemer. Holy shit! That shit was poison. He slipped a roofie in your drinks. He slipped a fucking roofie in my drink, Cena. Senna. Um, I'm sorry, Senna. I don't remember how I got here, honey. Oh, I'd love to help you figure it out. I shouldn't call her honey. That's chauvinistic. It is. I'm sorry. If you were to help tidy up and perhaps apologize afterwards, I might be able to help you. Tidy up. Tidy up. Whoa. Oh, what kind of temple is this? Yeah, I'm gonna tidy up right here for about five minutes. Uh, Emery, can you excuse me for a minute? No, I'm not leaving the room again. I know what oh, you do come on. when I leave. No! Shit. I gotta clean this place up, so, um, like, what does she mean? Just, like, throw some stuff around on the floor? Poof! There you go. Is that what you're looking for, kind of? So, uh, you remember anything I said when I got here? Did I say anything about, like, my pants being removed, my anus being touched in ways that I didn't want? You did say something about Rorikstead. Maybe you should take a look there. All right, well, I apologized. I'm out of here. I know that guy roofied me and had his way with me. You can't totally blame him, though. You're not blameless, because you definitely looked away. You know, you, yeah, you yeah, always true. keep your eye on your drinks. I know, that was stupid, but the guy was singing. Maybe that he paid that stupid musician to sing like crap as a distraction. That guy's pretty smooth then, you know, I give him props. Get one past old Aaron. Yeah, he, he got one past me. Oh, check it out, cabbage. Um, I have cabbage to sell. 
Honest pay for honest work. Yeah, absolutely. It's very honest since I just took it from, from you. <laughs> <laughs> what do you have to say for yourself? Uh, I'm sorry I stole your cabbage. Sorry's not good enough. Not while my Gladys still out there alone and afraid. You your kidnapped Gladys? her and sold her to that giant. What? Salted a giant? Uh, whatever you said, it sounds awful. You're damn right it does. Yeah. I'll never breed another prize-winning goat like Gleda. Dude, you stole a goat and sold it to a giant. Well, of course I did. <laughs> That's what happens when you get roofied. You immediately go find goats and sell them to giants. <laughs> I've, I've, I've had it happen to me in real life. Tell me everything and you won't end up like your goat. Okay, okay. Mm -hmm. uh, okay. I don't want to go to Whiterun. You were just there. Yeah. That sucks. This is stupid. All right, chicken. Uh, you can have this cabbage, mate. If you sell it to that lady over there, she'll give you a bunch of money for it. Yeah, you go get her and tell her there's some cabbage that you harvested. <laughs> My pleasure. That chicken's going to be the cock of the walk. The cock of the walk. Yeah. I don't think that's a phrase. You it just is a made phrase. that up. It is a phrase. It's not a phrase. It totally is a phrase. Cock of the walk. I think you meant the walk and the talk. He's... No, what? Boy, just getting drunk was a really bad idea, as yeah. it turns out. Now, I think I'm learning a lesson. So, you're finally back. Look, what? I've been patient, but you still owe me. Uh... What? Oh, what's wrong? Did the engagement fall through? Look, how about uh, we call it even, as long as you bring back the wedding ring. I don't care about the ring. Tell me what else I said. All right, all right. Yeah. You when you're sober. You better. You said the ceremony was going to be in Morvenskar. You said your friend Sam was going to be your best man. Oh, well, that's nice. You know what I find interesting is the fact that you were so shit-faced that you did all this crazy stuff, and yet nobody noticed that you were drunk because they're all totally surprised. That you don't remember any of that yeah, stuff. Yeah, so apparently whatever I drank, it made me act totally normal. <laughs> and no one, you know, was no one thought my behavior was weird at all. <laughs> Holy shit, that spell killed a mug crab in one hit! Yeah, that's going to be a good spell. All right, I guess I'm going to look for Sam up here and uh, try to find out what happened. Sam! Hey, have you seen Sam? Never mind. <laughs> you might not want to go through those flames. There you, you the trap that you set up. <laughs> <laughs> nice job. Uh, thanks for killing yourself off with your own trap there, people. You're like, oh, there's someone invaded our castle. Quick, to the trap. <laughs> Wait, should we go through our own trap? Yes, that's what it's there for. <laughs> oh. You're thinking too much. Just do it. Go. <laughs> Good old-fashioned henchman. <laughs> wow. Wow, no, that shows the true power of that spell. <laughs> that was awesome. She wasn't even near it. She just looked at it wrong. <laughs> it's too bad you kill those people before asking them where Sam was. They might have answered. I don't think so. These people are usually not very friendly. I've tried to recruit them to go to magic college in the past, and they just get really angry. They're like, to that boring place? I would never go to school there. Do you have any idea how much tuition costs? College is just a big scam. I don't want to be in debt for the rest of my life. And I don't want to listen to dipshits blather on for hours and hours about stuff that I can learn in two seconds. On the internet. On the internet. <laughs> Hello? Hello? Over here. Over here. Okay, I'm coming. Yeah, you like that? Whoa, what the hell's happening? Whoa. Whoa. Hey, uh, you should come and use this trap over here. <laughs> there you go. Come on over. No, it's fun. <laughs> huh. Meridius bacon? Mmm. Wow, I'll take a slice of that. Looks like a kidney stone. I won't be able to eat for days. A new hand touches the beacon. Excuse me? I'm um, just, can you wait a second? I'm busy. Listen, hear me and obey. Uh, I'm, I gotta a collect these troll spells. Has seeped into my temple. What? A darkness that you will destroy. Okay, I'll be right back. Return my beacon. Shut up, I'm collecting skulls. I'm gonna go to Misty Grove. Hello, Why, you invited me here, what's happening? Anybody? Whoa, a party! <gasps> Finally! Oh, yes! So, this is great because getting drunk led to like a crazy adventure and then another party. <laughs> Wow. You um, should always accept drinking contests from strangers. Absolutely. That's the moral of today's that Skyrim That is the lesson tips. we learned. Hey, this looks like fun. Hey, how you guys enjoying your food? Need something? No. Hi. 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 Hmm? Hi. No. <laughs> hmm? What's that supposed to mean? <gasps> ah, how do you like that? 
Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, these guys are all like duplicates. What the hell? They're all the oh same person. Oh my god, they're person. all the same person. What the fuck? Okay. This is the weirdest party I've ever been to. Did I have three drinks again and just not realize <laughs> it? Uh, I had quite a trip. What the fuck is happening? I thought you might not remember your first trip here. You had a big night. I think you've definitely earned the staff. Huh? Uh. I haven't been so entertained in at least a hundred years. All right, well, thank you, Darth Maul. Why did you choose me? Let's be honest here. Are you drunk? I don't always think my decisions through. I'm glad I could entertain you. My pleasure. <laughs> but I think it's time for you to go. Holy shit, I'm right back where I, I started. Except I know I'm carrying too much to be able to run. Well, that was interesting. Hey, you sold. How's it going? Hey, you sold. I'm sorry I was so rude to you the other day. Is that an amulet of Mara? I'm surprised someone like you isn't spoken for. Interested in me, are you? Have I turned into Yoda suddenly? Well, yes. Why wouldn't I be? Are you... interested in me? Why, yes, you sold. I am. It's settled, then. Brief as life can be in Skyrim, at least we'll have each other. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> I, I guess I have had one conversation with you, so... <laughs> this, uh, this will be good, right? It's funny, I mean, your interactions with her have consisted of you being completely hammered, and then the next morning intimidating her into telling you information, <laughs> and then the very next day proposing to her. Which she loves. She loves that. Yeah. She loves a good man who intimidates information. Whoa. <laughs> that guy was not excited about the wedding, apparently. <laughs> you sold this kind of a sweetie. Yeah. You know, I've had my my college relationship, and now I kind of know, like, what I want and what I don't want. Yeah, somebody with a low-cut shirt. That's definitely... Pretty much what you want. Miramar, Miramail, Mermel, Marmalade. Hey, are you okay? Blessings of Mara upon you. I'd like to have a wedding at the temple, you know? I just met this lady. You wish to she be married? Got, uh, some, some it's cleavage. good to see love blossoming, even during these difficult times. Yes, it's blossoming. Your wedding will be held tomorrow. Your wedding has been arranged. If only it was... That easy in real life. I hope Yasolda is like, fine with that. Usually the women want to make lots of preparations and stuff. Boy, you're getting married already. Yeah, this is crazy, man. After college, life just flies by. You don't think you should give Berlina a wedding invitation? Oh, yeah, you know what? I got her. I should probably invite her. Every time I come back here, Berlina and I, you know, we see each other in the hallway. It's kind of awkward. <laughs> I'm just someone that she used to know, you know what I mean? You didn't have to cut her off. Make out like it never happened and that you were nothing? I, I didn't have to stoop so low. No, you're just some asshole that she used to know. Exactly. Hey, how's it it's going? A fine day with you around. Come on out here. I'm sorry I said those things. I really am. I just wanted to let you know that I'm getting married. Her name's Yasolda. Um, she wears a low-cut shirt. She's, uh, you know, she's not ugly like you. And um, I just wanted to give you this invitation. So, yeah, you're welcome to come. Uh, maybe we'll see you there. All right, then. Okay, see you there. <laughs> she took that surprisingly well. Well, that's great. She's totally over me. Maybe she hasn't recovered from her head injury. Well, no, I doubt it. She doesn't probably even know who I am. <laughs> yeah, you know, I could probably uh, go have a little smoochy smoochy with uh, Berlina again, and she wouldn't even remember that we ever did it. <laughs> yeah, you'd never have to worry about her telling your new wife about it. Because <laughs> she would never remember that it happened. She's like the perfect mistress. Yeah, she's like the, <laughs> the girl with the head injury next door. Hey, I'm getting married. Did you hear? Scully, if you know what's good for you. God damn. <laughs> oh, wow. wow. I was just getting married. This is it. This is the big moment. Me and Yasolda. Can you believe it? I... After all we've been through? Yeah. It was Mara that first gave birth to all of creation. Yeah, well, that must have hurt. Ha! <laughs> <laughs> ha! You know how you know Yasolda's a keeper? She has never even seen your face. No, she, she agreed hasn't. to marry you. Oh, Look my it. God. Oh, my God. Lydia. Lydia's here. All of your exes hey, are here. Lydia. There's Berlina, she came! She totally came! I can't believe it! <laughs> <laughs> and that woman you sold cabbage to? That's amazing. Now, shut up, I'm getting married. Do you agree to be bound together, in love, now and forever? Stop the wedding, I can't- oh, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Under the authority of Mara, uh, you sold the wait. line of love, I declare this couple to be wed. Yay! Wait, you sold the- wait, well, aren't we supposed to go somewhere? Our new home. I'll see you there. Oh, she has a house? Oh, dude, she already has a house? SCORE! I graduate college and then I just move into some lady's house. <laughs> Next thing you know, you'll find out that she's rich. 
I can't wait to go to Yasolda's house. Oh, she's got a shit-tastic house. Oh, this is nice. What are you talking about? Shut up, you dick. This is my <laughs> wife. I'm home, honey. Honey. This house is very small. She isn't even here. Where the fuck is she? Where's your wife, man? My room at college was bigger than this. Your dorm. At least Tolfdor won't be wandering into my house now and sitting down at my chair. <laughs> now, why couldn't you have married the chick that owns that house? Look at that. That's huge. It's got an upstairs and everything. <laughs> you know, Emery? She lives on, like, the fucking edge of the city in, like, the shittiest house. God, right by the wall. This is, a ni this is a nice view. She's got, like, a scenic view. I don't know what you're talking about. You can't see shit. This is beautiful. <laughs> have you seen Yusolda? Trouble? Yeah, she, my, my wife. She's gone. It's two o'clock in the morning, she should be at home. Well, I'm gonna go sleep in my fucking bed, even if Yasolda's not gonna be joining me. She can sleep on the floor. Wow, what a great first day of marriage. Yeah, I don't know what I got into here. I hope I signed a prenuptial. Hello, my love. Hi. Back from some adventure, I bet. No, I just, I just was sleeping. Uh-huh, she just fell right asleep. She's wow. just like, whatever. Well, she was out all night. It's what, six in the morning? Yeah. She just walked in? She just came in. I wonder what she does. I mean, it can't be that good of a job. It's better not to ask questions, yeah. I find, you know? She doesn't ask you what you do. All right, well, I just need to uh, stop by the college here and pick up my stuff now that I've got a house. Yep. <laughs> well, you know, Jazargo, this is totally appropriate because it's the last time I'll ever he be seeing you. Cold, but Khajiit feels warmness from your presence. That's nice. <laughs> I'm sure you do. You know what? You can sit here forever because I'm fucking out of here. <laughs> Taking my skulls and I'm leaving forever. All right, I got all my skulls. I'm getting the hell out of here. Wait, 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 wait. What? Didn't that chick at the uh, inn say that there was some shrine around here? Yeah, that sounds familiar. Maybe well, I should go check that out while I'm in the area. Might as well. Maybe you get something nice to give to your new wife for a, uh, you know, honeymoon present. She always says I've been out adventuring. I guess it's time to prove that that's actually what I do. <laughs> and not just go to college. If she knew that your real job was to clean up dragon corpses and toilets, yeah, I'm never, I don't know if she would have married you. I'm never even going to mention that whole archmage thing, because it's just kind of awkward now. All right, this is uh, quite the little temple they got going on here. I like it. So do I go up, or do I go in? I think you got to do both to hit the G-spot. I'm not sure what that means, Emery. Hey, uh, what's up? Azura has seen your coming, traveler. Oh my really? god. She's got the deepest voice I've ever- She must be a smoker. Sounds good. What, uh, was this Azura want me to do exactly? You must go to a fortress, endangered by water. Okay. Yet untouched by it. What? What? Inside, you will find an elven mage who can turn the brightest star as black as night. I believe the fortress may refer to Winterhold. Winterhold? I'm the Archmage, I should know this information already. They don't tell me shit over there. Go talk to somebody at Winterhold. Oh, I am like the guy at Winterhold. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Greetings, Archmage. Oh, I'm the Archmage. Shut up. Oh no, I've been pronouncing it wrong all this time. Wait, 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 so does that mean you're gonna start pronouncing it correctly? No. <laughs> I would never do that. I enjoy pronouncing it the wrong way, so that's how I'm gonna do it. I'm looking for an Elvis May, um, Elvis May to study. Who sent stars. you? Was it the college? The Jarl? A priestess of Azura sent me, Persuade. You're working with the Daedra? Yep. Right. What, you don't believe me? Fucking tell me or I slit your nads. Just calm down. I'll tell you everything. Yeah, see, that always works. <laughs> it always works. The slitting the nads line. Yep. Always gets him to talk. Azura's star. A Daedric artifact that allows any number of souls to pass through it. I was working under Malin Varen then. If only we knew what he was really planning. What did Malin do, man? Malin wanted to alter the star. He was dying. Disease. He thought he could store his own soul inside. Seems like maybe that was a mistake. It drove him mad. Oh, Students yeah. started dying. Mm -hmm. Eventually, the college exiled him. Really? He took a few loyal disciples to Ilan Alter's Deep and vanished. Wait, the college actually did something? Wow. All this interesting shit happened before you became Archmage. Archmage. Ar Archmage. Don't sorry. ever say Archmage again okay. or I'll slit your nads. Oh! Alright. See, it I'll works. never do it again. It works in real life, too. Alright, so I guess we gotta find Azzy's star in Ilanalta's Deep. Don't you mean mm. Azura's star? Yeah, but uh, I think Azura's too hard to pronounce. She needs a nickname. So now we're pronouncing it Azzy. Azzy. Well, let's go up to the North Brittleshin Pass. I think I would like to call it North Titty Shit Pass. What a shitty... 
tits? Titty Shit. shits. Titty shits was not what you said. You said shitty tits. <laughs> I said titty shit. <laughs> but shitty, shitty tits, tits is good. North shitty tits pass. Okay, there we go. That's good. We agree on that. That's something. really offensive, so that's perfect. Whoa! Oh, yeah. That's how you do it. <laughs> little spinny sword action there. Man, you're like Leonardo DiCaprio with that thing. The end of Inception. What? S spinning. He's not spinning at the end of Inception. What are you talking about? <laughs> This is my job now. Adventuring is now my job. Yeah. Because I got to go find stuff and bring it back to the wife. Yeah, she she gets the food, she gives the yep. sex, and you bring back the dragon souls. Yep. Ilan Nolta's deep discovered. It was nice of this guy to leave his knapsack right underneath him before he died. He was probably killed because his hands were giant. Like, oh, seriously. Yeah. Especially his right hand. Massive, massive right hand. Wow. He must have had a massive dick. Because people that have, like, finger the, the span of their fingers between thumb and forefinger. So, yeah, he probably would have had a pretty good-sized wiener. Unless you measure her from his left hand, then it would have been average. That's true. I don't know which one to measure it. This poor guy's dick size will never be known. <laughs> <laughs> It'll remain a mystery throughout the ages. Oh, well. <laughs> It's a, one of those deep topics we talk about in <laughs> Ilan Ilan Alta. deep. <laughs> oh, this looks like a trap room. I bet there's sharks in the water. Electrified sharks. Wouldn't that be cool? Electric sharks? Yeah. <laughs> Doesn't make any sense, Emery. What, how do I get the goddamn railing ladder oh, steps? It's another puzzle. Bridge. You know what you should do? You should do that dragon shout where you zip across... Will that work? That won't work. You're just fucking with me. It's the like fucking... a falcon kick from All right, Super let's Smash try it. Brothers. Let's just try this. All right. Oh, yeah. I was right. Okay, so was that the actual way to get across? I don't know. I, you might have just been able to jump across and swim in the water. I was kind of joking about the, uh, the electric sharks. I know there's no electric sharks. <laughs> I really like that spell. It's like... It's fun. It's a slow, creeping, like, ball of doom, and they just never get out of it's the like way. It's like they don't know what to do. They see it, and they're just like, uh, what? <laughs> In fact, sometimes they walk into it. Yeah. They just go right into the danger zone. No, I don't think they do that. <laughs> I'm sure you know that song. Unfortunately. <laughs> now it's stuck in my head. Thanks a lot. All right, where is my special things that I wanted, that I came here for? The thing that will make all of this bullshit worth it. Yes, it's right around the corner, I'm sure. <laughs> Whoa. Dude, you broke it. Oh, whoops. Hey, I'm here now. I got the thing. Azura Star. Yeah. I knew the Lady of Twilight had sent you for a reason. No, I didn't actually take it out yet. Hand it over to me. Should I do it? I don't know. She does have a really deep voice, and I don't trust people with yeah, deep voices. Yeah, and she's like, give it to me. And she's dark. Like, yeah, it's like okay. Her clothes are dark. No, no, you said something racist. Just <laughs> admit it, and we'll move on. <laughs> oh, just take it. I will commune with Azura. Hmm, okay. That sounds like fun. <laughs> commune that! Oh, shit. I totally interrupted the communion. Hey, come on, get back up here and finish this. What are you doing? Hello? Oh, look, I did it. Yay! <laughs> Greetings, mortal. Hi. You have followed my guidance through the veils of twilight and rescued no. my star from Malan Varan. Yep. But his soul still resides within, protected by his enchantments. From this view, Until like, her boobs heard, look really, really body. massive. Yeah. Like stone boobage. Giant under boobage. Uh, is there any way to cleanse the star? I have some special gloves that I use to clean out the uh, fecal points at the uh, College of Winterhold. I will send you inside the star. You will banish Malin's soul there. Ooh, that sounds kind of sexy. Uh, okay, I'm ready to enter the star, apparently. Have faith, mortal. Mm -hmm. I will be watching over you. Okay, I won't. Ah, my disciples have sent me a fresh soul. I'm not a fresh soul, actually. I'm kind of old and stale. Oh, you know, uh, you know this experiment that you were doing in Superman's cave? It's over. Who are you to challenge me? I have conquered mortality itself. I've spat in the eyes of the Daedric Lords. Yeah, well, I took over a college in 12 days and got married to a woman in five minutes. Let's <laughs> see you do that. Aw, oh, yeah. Smack that bitch. 
I don't think so, you buddy. Better yield, jerk. Ha! Ah. Don't worry, mortal. I will return you before you are cleansed. Cleanse, cleanse, cleanse. What are you going to be using to cleanse me exactly? Clorox? My star has been restored. Oh, okay, congrats. And Malin's soul has been consigned to oblivion. Right. You have done well. You are free to use my star as you see fit. Cool. Oh, cool. Nice. All right, see you later, buddy. I have a surprise for my wife when I get home. She's going to love this. A big old bag of skulls. Oh, yeah. We sold, uh... Hello? Oh, she's never home. What time is it? Oh, that's right. It's 11.30. <laughs> Why would she be here? So that's what 50 skulls look like all dropping at the same time. She is going to love this. Oh, yeah. This is just like college, except better. <laughs> home is where the skulls are. This is nice. You sold, uh... Where the hell is she? No. Where does she go at 3 in the morning? I want to <laughs> fucking know. Well, she doesn't get to sleep until, you know, six, five or six in the morning. Yeah, well, what so... is she off doing right now? She's working. She's the lady of the night. Okay, that is unacceptable. Come on, you knew what you were getting into. No, she is not She's a lady of the night. a single woman with a low-cut shirt who makes enough money to have her own house. And she always stays out at night. I mean, what did you think she was? I, that What you're saying is so sexist and awful. Are you my wife? Anybody see my wife? Hello? Have you seen my wife? We are the children of man! Oh boy. That was a mistake. Maybe she's at the uh, Bannered Mare. Maybe. What would she be doing in an inn at 3 in the morning? I'm not sure, Emery. Maybe you should just shut up. Have you seen Yasolda? I enjoy this work well enough, but I'm ready to retire. I've been thinking of selling the inn to Yasolda. Anyway, what <gasps> do you need? She wants to sell the inn to Yasolda? What? Hell yeah! Where is Yasolda? Where the fuck? Need anything else? Well, sell it to Yasolda. I want to live here. This is ridiculous. Where is she? I don't know anything about her. I don't know where she works. I don't know what she does for a living. I don't know how she got this house. Why, why did I get married to someone I know absolutely nothing about? I think she just wanders the, the city at, late at night and helps, like, orphans and beggars. <laughs> That's what she does. She's, like, the best person that you've ever met. Why would that woman want to sell the bannered mare to your wife if she was just, like, out helping beggars at night? Holda? Yeah. Because she knows that, that Yasolda's a really good person. I'm just saying she goes in and out of that inn a lot. All right, I'm going to go home and she's going to be there. What are you going to do when she's not there? Hmm? What are you going to do? I have like 300 skulls to keep me company. I don't give a shit. Uh, Look, see? There she is. Yasolda, where do you work, honey? Hello, my love. Back from some adventure, I bet. Here. This is your share, love. What? Holy shit! See, look at this! She just gave you money! She is the best fucking wife ever. Alright. She what? gave me 400 gold, she cooks me the food. She, You know what she does? She wanders around at night and collects money on the ground. <laughs> That's you what just she's keep, doing. You just keep thinking that. You know what? Just because she came home with 400 gold <laughs> in the middle of the night doesn't mean anything. You don't know. My wife is not a whore. <laughs> I'm kind of, I was kind of offended that you called my wife a whore in the last episode, Emery. Uh-huh. You need to apologize. I'm not going to apologize, dude. I'm She's just... not a fucking whore. You're a fucking whore. That may be, but I think I know one when I see one. You give it out for free. You're worse than a whore. I'm going to go find Yasolda. I'm going to prove to you that she's not a whore. Okay, good luck. Yasolda, where are you? Maybe she's in the inn. Is this my wife? I forget what she looks like. That's not her. That's... Uthgird the Unbroken, who always wants to fight with her fists. What specifically is unbroken about her? Her her butt. <laughs> <laughs> it's really, you know, fancy way of saying anal virgin. <laughs> right. Anal virgin. <laughs> Uthgird the anal virgin just doesn't have the ring to yeah, it. Yeah, no, you're right. Unbroken sounds much better. Wait, is that your wife to the right? Uh, no. S sitting at the table? Yes. <laughs> Look, see, she's not a whore. She's just having dinner, you fuckface. Having dinner, you mean like having her in-between sex meal? Look at her eyes. She is not the type of person who goes and fucks a man for money. You can tell that just by her eyes. So, um, have we uh, made any more money in our store? We have a cozy little profit. Here, this is your share, love. Hell yeah. Wait, wait, wait. Half as much as yesterday. Well, it's a cozy little profit. Mm. 
Okay, so she she wasn't quite as busy tonight. That's why she's sitting around yeah, eating. No. And you know what? It hasn't even been a night. She's already raised two hundred gold in like a few hours. She's a she's a master mind. Okay, mm -hmm. Isolde, let's head out. Head out now. Let's go do your nightly rounds, baby. <sighs> I think she just sits in this tavern and drinks, and people bring her money. That doesn't make any sense. They're just like you look really cool sitting in the corner here. Here's ten gold. She just, she looks so awesome that people can't help but fucking shower her with coins. You know what kind of women get money for looking good, right? No, for being good. She's For she's, being good? Yeah, she's, she gets money for being good. And that, not in a sexual way. That's not how the world works, Aaron. You don't you know. Don't, you don't just get money for being good. Right, Yasolda? Back me up here. Come on. So, um, what ha what's going on? What'd you do today? Yeah? What, uh, what's the plan for tomorrow? Do you want to... You want to go for a bike ride or something, or? Oh, I've got an idea, you sold them. Me and you, we can go hitch a ride with. Yes, my love. What, I, what do you need? I, um, I don't know, I was just talking. I thought maybe you and I could go hitch a ride with Bajorlam and, and go see the world and travel. Apparently she didn't like that idea. <laughs> Get the fuck out of here. Wait, where, where are they going? Looks like they're kind of walking Shut up. the same direction. Shut up. They don't even know each other. They just happen to be walking together. You're so, so paranoid, Emery. Okay, just don't go in the house with her. <laughs> don't fucking go in the house with her. It's gonna happen, man. No, it's not. No, it's not. No, it's not. Look at, look at. Yes, they totally parted ways. Unless you, unless they had sex while they were standing next to each other, I don't think she's a whore. Wait a minute. If you go to bed, I'm gonna be really freaked out. What? In the fuck? I cannot wait while being asked to leave. Oh, you're in a fight. What the fuck are you talking about? She is pissed. Okay, that is really fucked up. I didn't do anything. I just tried. I was just talking about what she was probably walking with that guy, and she had to say, you know, we can't do this tonight. My husband's right behind us. And then he was like, I'm not giving you any money, and then walked away. Yeah, he that did. guy might have been her pimp. She doesn't have a pimp. What? Well, how else can you explain this? I mean, she was obviously waiting for him at that table. Except you sat down, and he came, and he saw that she was with you. And he had to back away. And then they tried to meet outside, but you kept walking around, following them around, and, you know. Yeah, well, I don't know what her dealing with that guy was, but I made sure it didn't happen. Well, my wife is angry with me. I think there's only one thing to do. What's that? I'm going to have to head up and visit the oracles. <laughs> ha! The oracles! Yeah. I haven't seen them in a while. Hello, ladies. Oh, God. Uh, Ergner, you might want to just... Dust your nose off. Have you been <laughs> sticking your nose in the ground, searching for truffles? <laughs> Hello, oracles. Hey. Hey, what are you doing? <laughs> what the fuck is wrong with everyone around here except for the oracles? The entire town is being plagued by horrible nightmares. Everybody in this town have Bieber fever? <laughs> Come down with a nice hot case of Bieber fever? Yes, they all have Bieber fever. What's your plan, dude? I need to return to the source of the problem, to Nightcaller Temple. Perhaps you'd be willing to assist me in that regard. Uh, I guess, uh, I don't have anything else to do. Uh, what do you mean? The hell are you talking about? <laughs> I've already said too much. If anyone overhears what we're saying, it could start a panic. I don't think they're gonna overhear with that music playing. <laughs> Just saying. Waking Nightmare? Oh, oh. Who is the Daedric Lord Vermina? Vermina resides in a strange realm known as Quagmire. Giggity. A nightmare. If you say that again, I'll punch your fucking ho hole in your bottom. My bottom hole? Your bottom hole will get fisted. <laughs> but then they won't be able to call me Emery the Unbroken. Anal virgin? What does she do with the memories, Erander? Who can say? Perhaps she collects them for display, like works of art in a nonsensical art gallery. Oh, yeah, a nonsensical art gallery. I like what <laughs> I'm hearing. Oh, strange men that you meet in bars telling you to go off on a mystery adventure with them into a deep, dark uh, you know, quagmire. We're, we're just going to go off to, to a nonsensical art gallery or something. <laughs> it should be fun. <laughs> What doing? are you doing? Are we going to... that hill is our destination. Oh, okay. Well, I'm glad you had to stop to tell me that. <laughs> He had to check his GPS. I think you might have stumbled across, like, the socially awkward pariah of Dawnstar. <laughs> <laughs> he just, you know, tells a bunch of nonsense about, a, you know, an art gallery and tries to get people to go there. And then on the journey, you kind of discover that he's full you of get up to You get up to the building, and it's actually, he just is conducting, like, asthma tests. 
<laughs> asthma <laughs> tests. <laughs> He's just like running a lab for, experimenting on people with asthma. Nightcrawler Temple discovered. Where's my buddy? Hi. Before we enter, uh -huh. I must warn you about the dangers that could be lurking within. Thank you, that is awesome. Thank you so much. This temple was raided by an orc war party seeking revenge. What? They were being plagued by nightmares, just like the people of Dawnstar. Oh, crap. I'm so glad you told me that. Were they successful? Knowing they could never defeat the orcs, the priests of Vermina released what they called the Miasma. Putting me asthma. I have. Oh, it's asthma. I have asthma. Yeah, he wants Thanks. me here to deal with me asthma. <laughs> <laughs> How the hell did you predict that? I knew it. All right, Arander. Nice and slowly. You know why this place was causing so much problems with asthma? Look at all that shit floating oh, in the yeah. air. Oh yeah. I mean, that's it's all that's all that's pollen. That's all pollen. Oh. God. Designed to provoke an asthma attack. Whoa! Turn purple. Oh look, it's just a big thing. Wow, that was kind of neat. You're rendered, but that was fun. This what? Is, is this the art gallery? This is the nonsensical art gallery. See right there, there's a painting made of sound. Whoa. And Yo, what's up, homie? Wow. Good job killing those asthmatic orcs, Arander. <laughs> the priests must have activated this barrier when the miasma was released. Oh, shit. That looks difficult to breach. Impossible, actually. Yeah, that's what I thought. Sounds like a job for Tom Cruise. Guzzler. Tom Cruise Guzzler. <laughs> My, he's a distant cousin <laughs> who no longer is married to Katie Guzzler. It's just up here. Okay, just take your time. I mean, really, I have nothing better to do. Oh boy, what's back here? Oh shit, it's a tunnel. <laughs> now what are we doing, fuckface? Yeah, that's what I thought. He was just standing there, hanging out. The things we need to do in here need to be done very slowly. If we move too fast, we might actually have some fun. Oh, I like this spell. Look at this shit. I want to put one in his ass. Did you like that? You like that? What am I looking for? <laughs> a book of alchemical recipes called... Called The Joy of Cooking. I thought your days of finding books was over, but... No. Apparently, apparently not. Apparently that will never end. Here we go. Located book. Speak to man. I located book. Now what we do? Let me take a look. Take a look at book. Ugh, I'm getting sick of hearing his shitty, stupid voice. Yeah, me too. I hope I can send an ice spike up his bung later. Where do we find the torpor, Rander, you little sexy little man? All believe there is a laboratory in the East Wing. If we proceed there, we should be able to locate a sample. You'll be viewing the memory of another through your own eyes and with your own body. Now, is it going to be an orc dream that I'm observing? Because I don't want to observe an orc dream. It's just gonna be all masturbating, <laughs> and like that's what orcs do. Yeah, they masturbate and kill. <laughs> that's their war cry. We go in, we masturbate, we kill. I think they kill first and then they masturbate. That's probably a better order. Oh no, we have to creep along like fucking invalids behind Erander. Take your time, honey. <laughs> we need to find the torpor. What's that? I'll begin searching up here. Should I go search somewhere else? The torpor should be in a tall bottle with dark liquid. Oh. If you find it, bring it to me. What? Look. Okay, I have a problem. What's the problem? He just spent three minutes telling me what this was, and then I walked downstairs, and it's sitting right here. It took me two seconds to find it. A goddamn arrow pointing right to it. But it, it took, like, three hours for him to tell me where the fuck it was. I'm gonna kill this fucker before the end of this mission. There's no doubt about it. I found it, it was two feet away. I've taken us this far, but you need to guard us the rest of the way. No. Drake. Here? Now? But, but, but. I don't fucking care, I'm drinking it. Suck it. <laughs> that guy can suck it. Drink! Whoa! Oh god, I must be having a bad trip. This guy's robes are disgusting. <laughs> hey, what's up there? What's this, everybody? Oh, it's this. Oh shit, is that a staff with a skull? Yeah. I need that. Can I just? Why can't I just take it? Take, take it. it. Get it. I want to take it. Blow it up. Take. Can you cast spells? Take. Nope, I can't do anything. Ah shit. Hello. Anybody? What happened? What happened? Oh god, what's happening? You guys okay? You guys can just keep going, I just need to skew down through here, excuse me. Uh, oh, maybe this is that nonsensical art museum. Yeah! 
This yeah. is like the nonsensical performance art part of it. Get him, get him. Oh, release my asthma. Finally! Shit, that's awesome, I'll finally be cured. Whoa, what the hell's going on? Oh, you're supposed to disable the magic barrier. Quick! Take that soul gem. I tried to take it right away, but it didn't work. Yeah, excuses. Hey, how's it going? It worked. Mara be praised. Yeah, all right. Mara, uh, you're praised. Erander, I am really upset with you, but you know what? I'm just gonna let it go for now. We can talk about it later. But after this is over, I'm gonna be really upset with you, and we're gonna have to have a talk. And the talk will involve a lot of ice spikes up your asshole. I'll just follow you. Take your time. Oh, of course, he has to pull out the mace and walk like a grandma. Yeah. Uh. Yeah, you never. You don't need to get up. Don't get up on my account. <laughs> hey, <laughs> one that could be your catchphrase. I think it is. It's my new catchphrase. Don't get up on my account. Yeah, it works every time when I say that. Don't get up on my account. <laughs> <laughs> oh, somebody got up on your account. Go back to not being up on my account. Get back on the floor. There you go. I like that. It was like a variation of the uh, catchphrase, which, you know, audiences enjoy. Yeah, exactly. They like to hear it again, but they like it when it's a little bit oh. retouched. Yeah. Bell, Thoric, you're alive. Bellows, Gorin, you're alive. Where's Franjoy? Where's Cram Nuggets? Where's Stimpy? Where's <laughs> Lumpkin? Where's Numble Wibbit? Where's Shorty the Muffin Chowder? <laughs> oh, shit. Defeat Varen and Thorek. Okay. They're done. Lady Mara, come on out. Let's have a good time, honey. He's deceiving you. Hello? When the ritual's complete, the skull will be free, and then Arinder will turn on you. Arinder would never turn on me. He loves me. Kill him now. Kill him and claim the skull for your own. You're telling me to kill Arinder. I do not have to be told twice. Yeah, right in the face. That's a good spot for that. And how about another one? There you go, buddy. I did it. Hello? I did it. Voice from wherever? Voice from the mysterious place that said I shouldn't trust him? Yeah. Skull of fucking corruption. All mine. That was a, a wonderful quest because I was tortured the whole quest by Erander, and then at the end I just got to massacre him. Yeah. If only all quests were like that. You know? Now that I think about it, why can't all quests be like this? Why That's can't you just go ahead and massacre everybody at the end of the quest? You know, that gives me an idea. What? Well, there's this little college that I'm the archmage of. Uh-huh. And uh, everyone there kind of sucks. I think somebody needs to die. I think a whole lot of people need to die. I totally agree with you. I don't think you can take them all on with just this spell that you have right now. I think you need something a little bit more... With a little bit more kick. Uh, I'm actually heading out, Yasilda. I'm going to go kill all of my former colleagues at the uh, College of Winterhold. Oh, uh, and uh, I'm a little short on cash right now. Uh, I might need to stop and get some lunch or something. Can you give me some cash? This is your share, love. <laughs> she is the best. Crotch has been getting in shape. Getting ready for this. Oh, he's getting pumped up? He is. He's Doing been, a little rocky routine? He's been working out. Okay, so here I am before. You can see, like, how, like, horribly disfigured and gross I was. <laughs> and there on the right is me after. After I've been doing all the working out. Uh, oh, you know, wow. Pumping iron. Damn, dude. Casting spells. Look at them gains. This is my new armor. It's um, all enchanted to give me some extra destructive abilities. In fact, now destructive... Spells cost nothing to cast. No way. Nothing? Is, oh, oh, look. look, it does. It costs like two. Almost nothing. It no. costs like two. Okay, yeah. nice. But I, I still don't think that's going to be quite good enough. I mean, yeah, you've worked out, you've got new armor, your destruction spells cost very little, but you don't have any big, like, area spells. Oh, I know, I know. I absolutely don't. Um, but I do have a plan. What's that? I think you're going to like it. I will show you. Uh, Feralda, I'm looking for a spell that will kill, oh, somewhere between, like, 12 to 15 wizards all at once <laughs> in uh, a snowy courtyard. Um, do you have something like that? Over the years, I've heard things. Powerful mm. magics lost to the ages. Incredible mm -hmm. spells that only the most skilled mages can master. This is the only thing I've ever found. I think it's better off in your hands. Oh, everything's better off in my hands. <laughs> 
Ha ha. Ha ha. Complete the book, Powers of the Elements. I think that will do the trick. Thank you, Feralda. I'll be back shortly to murder all of you. Examine the book to see what I can learn. That's a good idea. Oh god, I can feel my muscles just drooping away, my flesh <laughs> melting. Yeah, you should go drink a protein shake. I know. Alright, what is, what is it? Northward Han and Northern Coastline. Is this poetry? I think this is a riddle. And it's, south. Oh no, not a Dwemer of mine. Okay. Ugh. I quit. A simple place, a shield from draft? Like Canada? At this stand, wield mage's craft. It means cast some spells, brah. Uh, oh, at that place. Yeah. So fierce the sea will boil. So, a fire spell? Um, what's the northernmost shore? Probably, like, right up here. Alright, so go to, like, Dawnstar. Now, are there any, like, Dwemer areas near here that you know of? I don't know about any of that. Well, you know, there's this thing over here. What is that? It's one of those little hoopty hoops. A hoopty hoop? It's one of those little half-circle jerkers. Windward Ruins. Wind? Yeah, it's got wind in the title. Alright, I think we found this it. This is a protection from wind down there, check it out. What is that? A pedestal. Oh shit! Uh, hello? Anybody? It probably worked. Look at the book again. Oh. Oh, oh, for yeah. God's sake. They didn't even, like, inform me that it worked. All right, all right, all right. All right. Under Greybeard's Morning Shadow. At this northern watch, long lost. So, wait. Morning Shadow, where's that? Like, under their beards? Okay. That's their morning so, shadow. So, you know how the Greybeards live on top of this giant fucking mountain? Yeah. All right. In the morning, the sun is in the east, so the shadow would be on the west. So, that means that west of the mountain, at this northern watch, long lost. Oh, yeah. I know where that is. <clears throat> oh, you do? I didn't even read the rest of the riddle. Yeah, who cares? Okay. It's all bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. Hilgrin's no. Tomb? No. What? No, you're not even on the right side of the mountain. White River Watch. That's certainly possible. All right, well, I would say just start walking. Really? And then look for a place that's on your map that uh, you haven't discovered yet. Oh, what's that over there? I don't know. We've been looking for this place for fucking hours. These bunnies are trying to elude me. Die, bunnies. Yes! <laughs> yes! <laughs> bon voyage! Oh, I defenestrated the shit out of that guy. <laughs> wow. All right, let's get back to the quest, though. It's taking forever. <sighs> well. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Yeah, the thing on the map. That's exactly what the, uh, the first place looked like. So what? That, like, dome? Haven't we found, like, six Shit. other places like that? No, no, that's the first, like, dome-looking thing that we found so far over here. I'm yeah. convinced that that place up there is where you need to yeah, get Yeah, how the fuck do you get up there? I don't know. You can't. See, that's the answer. This is all just a fucking joke. Somehow I don't think this was the way they intended us to get there. Well, it's the way that we're getting there, so they can go fuck themselves. Oh, God. Oh, there, there it, is. it is! Holy shit! I just scaled the fucking mountain. Go to the place that is completely impossible to reach. You will find it by... Sheer dumb luck. Randomly scaling a mountain using a glitch in the game. <laughs> that was what the riddle meant. Of course, I should have realized. Look, this, just a, this, this leads to a fucking cliff. Where are you going? You haven't even done the thing yet, and you're leaving. Look, see? You can't go up this hill. I just wanted okay, to show great. you. Fuck! Why didn't you do the thing first, and then do this stupid shit? Because I wanted to show you that it's not reachable by any sort of path. I don't care! Oh god, that was such a nightmare. Well, oh we did god. it, so let's just forget that this ever happened. And move on. And never speak of it again. Yeah. Well, this looks like the place. Oh, thank god. So, we're supposed to cast a frost spell, so cast a frost spell, and then pick up the fucking book. Well, let's keep going. You seem so angry. I am angry! This better be the last one. Over yeah. western river waters, by Karth bounded south and north. On mountains sits a humble crown. Sky's That's wrath. That's one of those circular, half-circle okay. nuggets again. So, near Karth, we look for another circle butt nugget, and then cast some lightning. Fuck it, I'm going to Karth. Okay. Waston. Karth Waston. I've been looking for you. Got something I'm supposed to deliver. Your hands only. Let's see here. Let's see here. Oh, it's my dick. Your hands only. <laughs> oh, and sorry for your loss. Sorry for my loss? The hell's this guy talking about? Did your wife die? That oh my god. Sad. Oh my god. Oh, I have, I have like three million notes. Uh, I can't. You sold his message? Is it, is it that? Don't try to stiff me on this deal, Ulog. 
I can talk the Khajiit caravans into a better price than you'd be able to, and the guards are still looking for you after a skooma incident. Just bring the sap to my stu- Oh my god. Oh no. My wife is a drug dealer! <laughs> Holy shit! Oh my god! <laughs> that makes so much more sense than well, being a prostitute. Alright, well at least she's not a whore. Oh, 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 look, oh, what, oh. Why, look at God. It. Oh, it's so close. Holy shit. We made it. Oh god. Let that be the end of it. Oh, yeah. Sweet. All right, world. Witness my wrath. Oh, yeah. You know how many chickens I can kill with that? <laughs> I can't wait to go fuck up some assholes. As you remember, the College of Winterhold is a place where I went to school for a little while, and they made me do a lot of stuff that I didn't really want to do, like read, follow, listen. Listen was one of the quests. God, there was so much listening. It was just awful. It was really awful, and now everyone here needs to pay. Travis, wakey wakey, rise and shine! Whoa! Nice! Yeah, that is a cool spell. Yeah. Wow, I totally annihilated Drevis. Sergius, I really need to talk to you. It's an emergency. Sergius, wake up. The emergency is there's no ice spear through your face. Whoa! Where'd uh, he go? Bye. I gotta get out of here. Follow me out to the courtyard, everybody. My murder brings all my friends to the courtyard, and that's where I murder them hard. Yeah, that's right, I murder them hard. <laughs> Who, who's that? Oh, it's Feralda. Oh, Feralda. Yeah, those are heavy, aren't they? Yeah. They make you feel kind of tired. <laughs> See you later! <laughs> <laughs> well, it takes care of Feralda, everybody. Oh, wow, this library looks so well kept and well ordered. It would be a shame if a blizzard happened to go off in the middle of it. Yeah, that would be a real shame. Ha <laughs> ha! Oh, that is just pleasing to look at. Brings a tear to my eye. It really does. Look at all those books. <laughs> no one will ever be able to read them now. I'm sorry, but you've been suspended from the college. Yes, well, I'm about to suspend you from the college, actually. <laughs> this is my college, and I want everyone to fucking know that. <laughs> See you later, douchebag. I'm gonna clean this college up. Yep. I'm gonna make it the college that I always wanted it to be. Just me. Oh, no. I told you to get out of here. Get out! <laughs> I warned you, this is my college! Don't come back! Feralda, what do you think you're doing? I told you to stay out of my college, Feralda. Listen next time. <laughs> yeah, that'll teach you. Oh, hey, how's it going? I'm sorry, but you've been suspended from the college. I know, it's really lame, isn't it? I can't believe they suspended me. I am the Archmage, after all. It's kind of ridiculous that they would be allowed to do that. Anyway, what were we just talking about, Nerea? I can't remember. Well, here you go. <laughs> yeah, that should do the trick for you, huh? Okay, here we go. One, two, three! <laughs> oh, bad throw. <laughs> Bye! Where's Berlena? Berlena! Oh, hi, Berlena. Follow me, I need your help. Lead the way. Oh, Berlena, if you see Feralda around here, just push her off the edge. <laughs> And she'll go away for a while. Oh, who's this? Somebody who's about to die, methinks. Haha! <laughs> see you later, Phineas! Holy crap, did you see that? He attacked me, Berlena. I'm right behind you. Uh, Berlena, we need to head up to my, uh, royal apartments, if you know what I mean. Alright. Well, there's gotta be, like, a really pleasant, nice way to kill Berlena, right? <laughs> you should, uh, you should beat her the old-fashioned way. I'm gonna... <laughs> This is going to be so awful. I have some special gloves that I'm going to use for Belena. <laughs> if if uh, you're a sensitive person, don't watch this, okay? I'm just going to warn you right now. Oh, Belena. Come on. Fight me with your fists. Ow. She's hurting me. She's mean. <laughs> this was not as easy as I thought it was going to be. No more. I got. No more. I got. Oh, God. I feel so awful. I totally just punched Belena to death. <laughs> <laughs> That's really terrible. Well, oh, at least man. now she won't have to worry about that head injury. Oh, I feel so terrible. Oh, man. I Oh, look at What am I doing? Oh, my God. Oh, God. I should not definitely not put her on my bed. And oh. I shouldn't definitely never, ever going to have sex with her corpse. Oh. Oh. Oh, yeah. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. 
This is my old room, and look who's sitting in my motherfucking chair. You like that chair, huh? You like that chair? Well, good. You can stay in that chair forever. Oh, there he's you a go. part of the chair now. How's that? That looks good. There. You like that chair now? How's that chair working out for you? Let me out of here. Oh my god. Tolfter's pissed. I just need to heal up here a little bit. Everybody relax for a second. Uh, you know what? Guess what? They're too fucking lazy to follow me out to the courtyard. Really? I guarantee as soon as I left that room after killing Jazargo, they were like, Oh, well, let's go back to having some bread. Let's just wait and see if anyone ever comes out. Alright. Come out! I- I command you! You guys are a bunch of losers. Okay. <laughs> Tolfter, you really don't give a shit, do you? <laughs> hey man, uh, you know what would be bad for business? Help! I'm being attacked! Yes, you are. Is it difficult being away from your family? Not at all. I consider it a blessing. Oh, okay. My family was convinced coming here was a death sentence. <laughs> ah, well, you should always listen to your family, Anmund. Lords don't trust magic or those that use it. <laughs> Yay. Yay! Oh, he fell down the stairs. I didn't do it. He fell down the stairs. <laughs> I don't know what you guys. Why are you chasing me? Oh, look at who's coming out to greet me, just like old friends. Doesn't look like they want to hug me. Yep. You guys, I really want to thank you for coming out here this evening. I'm really glad we could spend this time together. Ring around the rosy. Arniel is an idiot. Oh, oh, little tricky there. Getting tricky, are we? Yeah. See you later, assholes. And there, my friends, is the last you will see of anyone at the College of Magic. Wow, that was really nice. I can't even express. Words cannot express how utterly joyful that every second of that was. Oh, <laughs> uh, so what to do now? Uh, it's time to go back to the wife, and we're gonna have a fucking party. Awesome. Okay, I gotta find my wife. Yesolda. Yesolda. Yes, my love? What do you need? Well, I just killed everyone over at the college of Winterhold, where I went to school, and had a really good time. Can you cook me some food? Here, this is fresh. I'll have another meal ready tomorrow. Oh, thank you. Oh, uh, Yasolda, I have this letter. Let me just show it to you. Uh, it says here, I can talk to the Khajiit caravans into a better price, blah, blah, blah. Skuma incident. Just bring the sap to my stall in Whiterun like we discussed. Now, this is really upsetting. Why are you selling skooma from a stall? You really need a better place to sell your skooma, honey. And I'm going to take care of that shit for you. So, yeah, I've had my eye on the bannered mare for a while. It could be a nice place for Yasolda to, you know, do her business less out in the open, you know? Yeah, instead of having this stall out in the middle of the, uh, of yeah, the town. Yeah, that's just, you know, she's just asking to get caught. So we'll do it in the inn. We'll make it a bigger business. We'll try to supply skooma to, you know, the entire, like, Tri-City so area. So, you're gonna buy it from Hulda? No. I'm going to kill Hulda. <laughs> Alright, well that takes care of that. Uh, just don't pay any attention, everybody. Uh, that was, uh... Order of the Yard. Stop right there. Oh, uh, I'm so sorry. I don't know what happened. I, I got drunk and then, um, you know, uh, before I knew it, I had electrocuted Hulda and... Oh, I'll just pay that fine. That's no problem. Thank you. Smart man. Oh, now. thank you, sir. Okay, and I'm going to set up a drug dealing business here, too. Is that fine? Okay, thank you. Now to head home and tell Yasolda the news. Yasolda! Yasolda! Damn it. Uh. She was just in here, sleeping. Where'd she go? Think she's over the bannered mare already? Filling out the necessary paperwork? I certainly hope so. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, honey. Hello, my love. Back from some adventure, I bet. Yeah. Has our inn made any money? Here. This is your share, love. Oh, now we're talking. Yeah! That's some good drug money. Moving up in the world. Yeah. Oh, uh, this is beautiful, isn't it? Just me and you sold attending the bar. Husband and wife. Pretty soon we're going to shoot out a couple of kids. <laughs> a couple of mini guzzlers. I think you should uh, roast some bodies on that fire. Oh, that's a great idea. The security in White One is terrible. Shameful is what it is. Hey, do you want something to eat? <laughs> we're having roast pig tonight. Yeah, he's going to toast up real nice. Mmm, yeah. What are you doing that for? <laughs> <laughs> I'm hungry. What does it look like? There's two options tonight for dinner, everybody. Uh, roast pig and roast lamb. <laughs> Take your pick. I'm a vegetarian. Well, then you can have bread. <laughs> <laughs> oh, boy. Here we go again. 